and welcome Yay. to Tales of Olympus. <laughs> First try. Mm -hmm. Yay. You did it. Mm -hmm. I did ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba. it. Just a couple different camera settings today, so you know, it worked the first try. First try. How's chat doing today? I see y'all talking about other potential D&D &D series. We were just doing the same. Were we muted? <laughs> Probably. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I chat, hope so. chat literally saying, yeah, man, I, I hope that this person plans this, 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 and this, and it's, how did they know? <laughs> <laughs> but yes, we are here, unfortunately. Yugi is unable to join us. Richie is eating food, and Michael is just moved and does soon. not have his webcam set up, so... I'm just, I'm just here. Can we get a gift of a loading icon on my webcam? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> Amazon.com. Webcam. <laughs> yeah, can you get that on Prime now? It'll be with you just... in an hour or two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Melt the stream, set it up. <laughs> do you just not have one at all anymore? Um, I do, but it's kind of busted. Fire enough. So, nice to buy a new one. All right. Fortunately, for ninety-nine percent of webcams, they're all the same price. So. Yeah. 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 True. So it's simple. Two grand. Nine twenty. You're good to go. <laughs> <laughs> it's not, not wrong. Yo, but, uh, yo, yo. So it's been a little while. Talk webcam streams. Yeah. Three weeks. Has it been three weeks? I think Has so. Three weeks. Mm. I thought it was two weeks. It might be two. Two months? It's definitely two. <laughs> no, 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 this isn't Skyrim D&D, where we Ooh, skip months at a time. Yikes. It's called a time skip, guys. Come on. It's, uh, yeah, it's, 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 a spe it's a new spell that I learned. I used it off screen. It's great. True. We're like level 77 now, right? Yep, that happens there's, in D&D. Definitely there's max level isn't 20. <laughs> definitely not. Fighting three beholders in this one episode? Yep. Oh my god. <laughs> We're actually fighting the god of D&D itself. Ooh. Wow. So yeah, how's everybody been? Like, it's been a, it's been a hot minute. Oh, yeah. You know. We have been. I moved across the country. Mm-hmm. <laughs> nice. How's England? The country, I'm, not world. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if, if it was across England, it would have taken them 25 minutes. Okay. Yeah, he's not. What is Florida but the England of the South? Hey. I don't it think takes that's about the four case. hours. I am positive that's not true. <laughs> that is probably one of the farthest states from mm -hmm. England. I don't know. Well, there's, there's there's rain. It's a very different kind of rain, though. I think arguably you would say New England is the New England of Florida, of, of America. <laughs> I guess that's arguable. That's lame. Thing, at least the name. You tell me New York's the New York? Well, yeah, yeah, but that was the entire reason it was named that way. Dang. Mm -hmm. right. Well, it was originally named New Amsterdam was... first, so uh, yep. But then it was renamed in the favor. <laughs> well, no, and then the English took it from the Dutch. <laughs> yeah, because we don't suck. Wow, sorry to our Dutch audience out there. <laughs> yeah, I know. Jeez. Poor Dutch, man. The Revolutionary wow. War says differently. <laughs> yeah, well, you know what? That wasn't even Americans. That was just a bunch of French and, and Netherlands and all of them just coming together. Ooh, so you're saying <laughs> pretty much. So you're saying we're better at making friends than you? Yeah, we were <laughs> arguably not true. I would, People <laughs> like us better. I would say you were. <laughs> what? Every Ooh. country loves America. Mm. <laughs> we give them all so much money. They have to like us, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> bribery doesn't work what are you saying moving forward <laughs> <laughs> but yeah we got D D show um i guess we're gonna have to do a recap of what happened last time but i'm ready to go when you gentlemen are mario what are I you am. sipping and why is it just red syrup ready is it cough it, syrup it's not cough syrup right it's here. just the t it's just the sparkling water with the uh with the uh Oh, what was it called again? Food coloring. And a lot no, of yes, it. Yes, food coloring. Tomato juice. <laughs> Cranberry. Sparkling uh, tomato I... juice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's like carbonated milk. 
<laughs> Get one of those soda streams and just fill it with milk. Yeah. Mm. Oh. Mm. I love I got... my milk bubbles. <laughs> hey, wouldn't that just be like a, a frother at that point, right? Mm. <laughs> Might not be how the same, same process, but same Very result, maybe. flight part of it. Take a break and go hey, try that out now. make your entire audience throw up. <laughs> All right, so yeah, last time on Tales of Olympus. The gang on the back of a giant island turtle found clues about Echidna and who her, who her seven children were. As they are conducting research, one of their members, Bell, is kidnapped by a griffin and taken hostage. After the gang defeats the onslaught of enemies, they are kicked off the island turtle and hurry after the griffin to save Bell. As they arrive to the island, their boat begins to sink due to some mer people attacking it. As they are fighting off the enemies, a giant blue dragon begins to strike down and electrocute them all. Upon his defeat, a whirlpool opens up beneath their feet. They dive into it, believing this to be the entrance to Atlantis. We open up with the gang walking around in a futuristic looking room. Oh, that explains the superhero music. Futuristic looking room. Their bodies aching. Their bodies aching in pain. They look around and don't see any sign of Bell. Instead of Belle, they do, however, notice Theodore curled into a ball in the corner of the room. Um, so, um, it's the Gungan City. Excuse me, the what? The Gungan City. That's repeating it, dude. Didn't help me. I'm gonna be honest. Oh, look, it's. Is that like from some sort of anime or something? Yeah, it's from Are Star you Wars. Stuffing again? Oh. Ah, weeb stuff. Gotcha. Okay. No. Uh, so, like, uh, where exactly are we then? Are we underwater? Are we uh, in another universe? Technically, we're on Naboo. Nafu? Naboo. It's no. another planet. In the galaxy. Don't tell me we're How far on away? planet, dude. I don't need to hear that we're on another planet. I have to be home. Rager, dude. It's a big one. Biggest one of the year. You never had a space rager before. Yeah, true. I don't know. Wait, how have you had a space rager before? Naboo, dude. Hey, this rage is gonna be out of this world. To be fair, I don't know if Vinny's ever had one out that's an out of space. There's a lot of parties I've never attended that he says were epic. There's a lot. True. I think you're just a bit of a like wussy, alright, dude? I'm going to be honest. He kind of just sat in the corner, cried, peed your pants a little bit. Speaking of sitting in the corner, crying and peeing your pants, Theodore, is that you? Oh. Will you guys just keep it down? No. First time I've actually got to sleep while I've been here. Too bad. We need to know what's happening. How long you been here? Yeah. How long has it been since we last seen each other? Uh, More than one week. Day. Yeah, a week or more, maybe? About a week or more, then. Great. It's been a while. What have you been doing? Uh, fighting frog gods. But yeah, we can uh, do that, too. Got stuck into a whirlpool. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Woke up here. Got, like, <clears throat> dissected a little bit and attacked. You got dissected? Dissected? They did like they did a few tests on me. Yeah, it's, it's been it's been crazy. Kind of just been held here as prisoner for a few days now. It seems. What? Fantastic. Huh. So wait, if you're here and you're a prisoner and we're here, are are we also now pri prisoners? It would appear so. So you haven't gotten any. Smarter since the last time we met. Look, I just thought, you know, the, I thought we were going to get luckier than this. I'm going to be honest, guys. Sorry, this Look, one might we, be on me. Um, we came here for you because we did what you asked, and you told us to meet you. Yeah. I told I you to meet me at the house. Yeah, well, we, went we went to the house, and then we saw the thing that said you went to an island of Florida. One of your uh, uh, drones or something. Came to us a little ominously. I no. I sent it for I sent it for help. Yeah, it's just, I didn't expect you guys to be the help. Well, Why I stand up, help my arms around the empty room. Your help has arrived. 
I'm more surprised that you didn't expect us to be the help, dude. All things considered. Did you complete your mission at least? Well, uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. What was our mission again? Which one? Oh. He sent, sent us on multiple ones. Was this the Egypt one we're talking about? Yes, okay. yes. Yeah. No, the Danny DeVito oh. one. Oh no, we still haven't found Mr. DeVito. Uh, no. That one we haven't. Did okay, Did you guys find the stone tablet? Yeah, we, we got have it. it. <laughs> Please tell me you left it out of the house. No. Did we not? Pretty sure it's in the bag. Oh. Yeah, you no. know, we got that bag that can uh, hold things what bag? easy. So. It's hmm. like a bag with lots of space. It's you... like a bag, but the inside of the bag is bigger than the outside of the bag. Look around, you idiots. Do you see the bag? Doesn't uh, Harry have I look the bag? At Harry. No. <laughs> Do I still have my bag? No, all it seems like all your belongings have been confiscated. Even my walking stick? Uh so yeah. So the walking stick's been taken. Oh, all all your rings have been taken, except the uh fox ring. What about my earpiece? Do I still uh, have a... that has been taken. Huh. That has been taken, okay. Uh Vinny has a stick still. It's a normal stick. Yo. <laughs> you bet I do. What about the Vinny brew? Did they take that? That is uh, still. He has a vial of it in his pocket still. Heck yeah. Your goblet no, was also taken. Take the video. No! <sighs> what about my deck of cards? With the special cards uh, tucked in. You're, you see, the deck looks smaller than it used to be. Oh. Took all they my went. aces. <laughs> they, took, they took all your good cards. My precious. No, you have a bunch of twos and threes. Yeah. Richie, in your, in your head, you just hear, we'll, we'll take revenge on them for this. Yes, we oh, will, my precious. Man. Yes, we will. Hey, uh, you they all right over there, it. Isaac? They stole it. Isaac, you don't think uh, maybe I could carry huh? that for you? No. I could carry it. Share the load. No! It's mine! It's my ring! You can't have it! Chill, dude. Alright. I'm just Why trying to help. Why are you yelling, dude? Yeah, you okay? It's just, this is my burden to bear, not yours. It's a burden? I don't care about you, stupid ring man. They took my cup. My, my red solo cup. We'll get you your cup back. Me up. Can... Right. Look, we're here for. Have a party. Are we here for good reasons? We're supposed to be here to save him. And, and yeah, I, I guess. Well, I really... What are you doing here? I I came here looking for the other half of the tablet. So I, it's here. I take it you it, didn't get it. It. I've heard. I've heard the guards talking about something of value being stolen from the place. I don't. I don't know the civilization, but, but that's yeah, how it may. Yeah, it could be a lot of that. Oh. Look, we just I haven't. Back. I haven't had much time to, you know, talk to the king of the place. So I haven't really had a chance to figure out what's going on. Well, they kind of saw okay. us as intruders attacking Atlantis. That's understandable, really. Just gotta let them know that we're here for good. Good yeah, reasons. Man. Are, are we here for good reason? Probably. I, I mean, we're fighting off monsters, trying to figure this all out. Trying to stop a mother of monsters from doing crazy things. True. I'm sure they have their fair share of monsters down here. Maybe if we like... Yeah, you're right. There are monsters everywhere around here. Go talk to the guards. Um, I feel like this is a loaded, a loaded suggestion. I feel like you're trying to say something without saying something. So if you want to just say it, then you can say it to me. Have you heard of evolution and adapting to the, and the environment? Yeah, sure. Okay. You know, that's like Darwin's theory. You know what I mean, dude? Well, you know, to us, we're normal. And yeah. things that you have been fighting are the monsters, correct? 
Sure. Understand. Okay. Yeah. Well, to them, they're normal, and we're the monsters. Oh. So what you're telling? So they don't me look is... like Jason Momoa down here. Unfortunately, not. They look more like Ooh. creature from the Black Lagoon. Did I hear mimosa? Uh, no, no, not I quite. Could really not use quite. That's what you took from that. Listen, dude. Well, they uh, I'm going they on took the his cup, already. man. They took my cup, man. They took everything. Mm. Well, I got my stick still, and a little bit of vial of Vinnie brew. I just pop it out of my back. Maybe pocket. you should get the stick to the old man without the walking stick anymore. No, my stick. Well, they took my stick, so they clearly are smart enough to realize it's special. They took a lot of other things that, you know, they, most people wouldn't realize is special. So, whoever these Gungans are, whatever you wanted to call them, they're smart. So perhaps they can be reasoned with. You realize I was joking about the Gungan, right? I don't know. What is Clearly, it? this is Atlantis. Well, yeah, but I didn't know. Oh, it is? That's what we're at? Oh, God. Obviously. I thought it was supposed to be cool, though. Like, I never imagined being a prisoner in Atlantis. Does I it not look imagined... cool? Well, being a prisoner in Atlantis, no, it doesn't look cool. <laughs> I gesture towards Theodore. No offense. None, none taken. It looks like he's been here for a while. Yeah, how long have you been dirty. here? You know, like you said, like a few days, maybe a week. Okay. What do they feed you here? Is it just fish, or...? That a seems carnivorous. A lot of chum. That's inhumane. Oh, so they do. Well, I mean, most of nature is cannibalistic, dude. Kelp, yeah. seaweed. Circle. You're not enjoying mm. your meals here, are you? You can only eat so much sushi before you get sick of it. Of course, the Atlanteans are vegans. All right. Um, I don't think eating fish is vegan, bro, bud. I'm eating seaweed. I'm guessing you have already yeah, looked. Yeah, but he also mentioned fish. I'm guessing you've looked over. The, I'm guessing you have looked over the cell like over a dozen times, looking for any weaknesses, ways to get out. I mean, there's. Yeah, if anything, one of you two would be able to spot that sort of thing. It's not really. It seems like they don't. They never really expected a cell to be needed, so it's kind of like a repurposed security room to an extent like you, you guys look around the room you see computer stations and stuff like that throughout the entire room could we hack into the security system maybe you could attempt to uh yeah that being, that being said even if we do escape what will that do for us what are we going to escape to the bottom of the ocean yeah do you know a way out of here he mentions then in the next room over there's just you know and an, there is the exit over in the next room over but there's two guards blocking it Two gods, no problem. Okay, let me... Well, I think we should if try we could... diplomatic means voiced. Well, for, let me try to hack into the computer. If I, if we can get in, maybe we can learn some stuff and maybe use that to our advantage later on. Or if How they catch you, you hacking into computer, their system, dude. then they're just gonna never trust us again. Yeah, what if this isn't even, like, typical technology? I thought, like, electricity doesn't work underwater. It's... I'll... This is obviously not basic technology. This, this is... is a magical place. Yeah, all the technology you see around you is definitely far more advanced than you've ever came in contact with. So it is going to be very difficult to even try to access it. I say let Harry Higgy give it a go. We haven't got a better idea. Unless you want me to make one of you guys tiny and let you guys sneak into the other room and listen in. Uh... We don't even know if that would change anything. I would be in tiny help. Yeah, to listen in to the guards and see if there's anything they say interesting. I mean, my... But how would be in tiny help? I think it's slipping through like a doorway Yeah, or you can't make us small enough to slip under a door, right? We've only seen you shrink or grow things like half or twice their size. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Let me see. I mean, if I'm running around I'm three foot tall, I mean, unless I'm being one of his yeah. little hobbits out here, I don't know if it's going to help anything. I mean, what if I turned myself okay. into a fly and made me half the size of a fly? Possible. Yeah. Question, are we, like, yes. underwater or anything like that, or nah? Uh, How damn the is room, the surrounding? The room is completely dry. Okay. 
I'd assume so, otherwise we wouldn't be able to talk and we'd be drowning. Yeah, I was assuming so, I just wanted to make sure. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna yeah. try... What do I need for the computer? Uh, make me a yes. Make One me a second. yes? <laughs> make me a yes, please. Let's get the, the skill list up. Alright. Basically, he's uh, saying you need manners. <laughs> computer. I would like to sneak up towards the door as far as I can. Alright, you make me a stealth check. Tobias. Alrighty. Uh, just intelligence to see if you can even figure out how the computer operates. Uh, Mario. Alright. 17. Alright. Uh, you you managed to figure out the power button on the machine. But it's not a stereotypical uh, QWERTY keyboard. And you know, really don't even understand half the languages on it. So you don't even know how to put the password in. So you would just be sitting there for hours at a time putting random combination of letters and numbers on there. Mainly you don't even want me to attempt this. <laughs> okay, I get it. Well, you have hours if you want to try. I mean, but as for you, Tobias, you managed to get up to into the room where the guards are in. Okay, is there any sort of door here, or can I physically see them? There is a... The, yeah, there's you're, that opens up into the straight next room. Oh, okay. So we're not yeah, connected. All those, yeah, all those rooms are connected. It's just right where the, the guards are standing is the only way out of there. And it's all, you know. all dry. Uh, and we, where the guards are standing, you can see a, a like electric door there. Okay. What do you see? <laughs> I walk on back, explain. The guards are standing there in front of some sort of door. So even if we did take them out, doesn't mean we would necessarily be able to get out. But there is potentially more areas that we could get to if we find a way to distract them without alerting them to I mean, are we sure they're even going to attack us? No, we're not. I could go talk to them right now and see what's up. Well, why don't we do that? I think that's the best course of action, personally. Just didn't want to go sneaking around before doing that. I mean, I guess we can talk to them, and if it goes south, we'll kill them. I mean, maybe we could, we could try to do other things before killing. Especially without weapons, that might be a little more difficult. We're not sure how strong they are. They seem to got their, their own environment here. They have some sort of advantage, so... Right, if they attack us... What are you going to do without your ghost. swords? What are you going to do without your bow? going to punch them in their face. <laughs> Can I attempt to grab Isaac by his skinny wrist and hold it up? <laughs> um, Make a strength check. Unless you want to go into bear mode. Nah, I'm, I'm just... Reaching right, and normal. grabbing it, so if he resists, he resists. It's not. I don't have good strength, but. All right, so you have to you have to break break a six to break out of his grasp. I mean, I sure hope I can. <laughs> uh, saving throw, I'm assuming. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I can. Yeah, you with no resistance. What are you whatsoever. doing? Look, I don't think you can take take him on without a weapon. We'll see about that. No, we, I don't. We'll hope to not see about that, right? Well, we'll see about that too. All right. Um, just try not to look threatening if we're gonna go talk to him, right? Me threatening? Okay. I uh, step out into the room, hands like partially up in the air. Right. Hello. As you approach the guard, you kind of start over here and then saying, like, why are we here guarding these stupid humans when we got, we need to be out there finding that stone? And then as you say, hey, they look around. What is it? What do you need? We would like to know where we are, why we're here, and if there's anything we can do to help. Oh, well, you're in our jail. Yes, that's what we're going to call it, a jail. Fair enough. Uh... You intruded on the royal the royal ground. If we had Thus. unintentionally, but fair enough. And your third question was what again? Um, is there anything can we, we can do to help you guys get ourselves, uh, you know, out of here? Just oh yeah, you want to get out? He just drops the uh, electrical door. Water starts flooding in. Okay, yeah. See, we don't do well underwater. 
So yeah, uh, we need a proper. You know, you know how we came in through like a well pool. Is there like a well out? The water just starts rising. Gets up to your ankles. Okay, okay. You, you made your point. You made your point. You have. This is your place. We're not here to change that. True. Close the door now. You, you, is the water still flowing in? They close the door <laughs> and it starts draining back out. Okay. I don't know what kind of suspicions you guys have. You don't know us, so I, you know, you don't have any reason to trust us, but I, we don't have any intention of harm when it comes to you guys. And we certainly hope you don't have any intention of harming us. I think we could all get along, and if we did accidentally trespass on someone we weren't supposed to, then perhaps we could do something to repay our debts. Answer me this. Why are you even here? Our friend went missing and we were looking for him. Your friend, the uh, other gentleman in there? It's hard to yes. say he's a friend, but he's a family member of one of our... One of our friends. <laughs> I applaud you. Family is very important. It takes a lot of courage to travel to the unknown for your family. Right. Yeah. Now, what was he doing here? That uh, I do not personally know 100%. I'm assuming you guys asked did you, him. Did you ask him? Some of your people may have asked him. Yeah, he, uh, he had mentioned some stuff. Not sure how much we believe about half it. From what I do know, Whoa. he was looking for some sort of information to help our people up in the, uh, Land above. Well, please forgive us for the uh, not being hospitable to you guys. You guys are trying to be safe, I understand. But you understand, you must understand a little bit of what happened. Shortly after his arrival, our uh, precious uh, stone got removed from our clutches and was stolen. We are led to believe it was due to him. I think we can confirm it wasn't him. If it was him, we'd probably, we'd probably know it, but it's hard to say. I mean, the stone, we don't know as much about it as you guys do, but... We believe he was working with the scoundrels of the deep. Who? Uh, who? The scoundrels of the deep. Who's... Do you know who that is? The underlings, the uh, the nuisances of Atlantis, if you will. Hmm. Doesn't ring any bells. I mean, we. we I'm sure you've never heard of them once. <laughs> no, no, I never. But hey, if they have the stone, if you let us out, we could go find them and get it. We could try. And you'd bring the stone back to us? Yeah, we just need our gear. To well, once again, them. he did come here looking for information, so if we were able to look at it, that would be wonderful as well. And what kind of information was he in search for? Something to do with monsters up on the dry land above. So, I'm not sure if this is a similar thing or not, but... Apparently, we're all special where we come from. That's fairly important. We have a saying around here. You rub my fin, I'll scratch yours. Let me go talk to the king, see what we can do. I don't know if I like that saying. <laughs> and they both. It. Not above they both, fin rubbing. They both begin just to walk off. Let's go see if Theodore knows anything about these guys. Didn't want to say anything to them, but he would 100% work with some shady figures to get what he wants. We could. We could explore the rest of this place. You want to go take a look while I talk to Theo? I mean, sure. You know, we should have a good look at the ground. Know what we're standing. We'll split up. Very well. Vinny, you want to go with him? Take a look around? 
Yeah, I'll do it, sir. Uh, me and Harry will talk to his uh. Okay. His relative here. All right. All right let's cool. go ahead and do Vinny and Isaac right. real quick. Yep. Okay. All right. We're just gonna walk. I guess we'll go. What is this right here? Is there a doorway or is this? Just yeah, it's just a door? automatic door that, as you approach it, it opens up. All right, we'll walk through this hallway. Should the hallway. Yeah. Standard. Yeah, the, just the yep. normal hallway. Okay, we're walking into this room. What do we see? It looks so. Uh, there's some like eggs on the in there, and little pods that also have eggs just sitting in the pods. Uh. Think we can cook these. No, I don't think we should. I'm going to be honest. No. I don't think we're going to get a pretty interesting omelet out of these ones. I mean, it could be like fish eggs. Like caviar? I mean, we could make caviar. I don't think that's how that works. Are you saying? Um, I mean, I've never uh, made caviar before, dude. But I'm pretty sure that stealing from these guys... What is possibly their young is just a bad idea in general. I'm yeah, I guess saying. you're probably right. You know. What about these uh, things on the side? What are these? Uh, they're just more pods that have eggs inside of them. Okay. okay. Do you see anything like moving inside the eggs? Or are they like transparent? Are they opaque? It's solid. <laughs> uh, they're a little see-through. They're a little. Uh, you see like little tadpole-looking things. Oh. Just oh, squirming around gross. inside. Mm. You know, uh, you that's know what? A French delicacy. I uh, listen, man. I'm all about nature, but this is this is where nature starts to get a little bit funky, dude. All right, all right. No. We'll just we'll just we'll just keep looking. Yeah. We'll go to the this. I assume is a stairway. Yeah, it's a stairwell leading up to the next room. Okay, we'll go to the next room. What do we see? Uh, in that room, room is just uh, just a bunch of windows really okay okay let's look out the window yeah, so... and see. uh out the window you notice just uh, a very calm looking ocean you seem to be fairly below the sea level okay but uh okay. as you're staring out a giant uh plesiosaur just oh. swim past you oh great okay. that's a dinosaur that's a really it's a big one. Okay. Is that what that is? Yeah. Huh. Well, so, not everything's as unrealistic as we thought. Is there I anything mean, else in this room besides windows? Not really. There's just some some technology that you just really can't understand. It looks uh, more some like it looks to you like a disco ball. Are there yeah. any buttons I can buttons? push? Yeah. <laughs> We're only a D20. Okay. There are buttons in the room. That's what the button does. Okay. All right. As you press the button, the uh, disco ball that was in the center of the room just starts, like, flashing lights. Ooh. So this is a party room? Lights. Is there, like, a bar in here somewhere? But he's just staring at it, like, kind of mesmerized. Can you I press the like... button again. A oh, bim. I'm not gonna push the button. Okay. Uh, can I just instead of just pressing the button, can I just kind of push all of the buttons? Is it a keyboard or is it like what's it like? Yeah, it's just a, a keyboard of buttons. Okay, can I just like slap the keyboard and just go all across it, just hitting everything? <laughs> <laughs> do you go like a piano with like finger yeah. slide or do yeah, you yeah, smash? Yeah. Like hand on the keyboard, push down and across. Hitting everything. Uh, yes, yes, you can. Okay. <laughs> Press okay. The side. So as you do that, the lights on the uh, so it begins with the lights on the uh, disco ball uh, mm -hmm. to start like turning on and off in a rapid fashion. Starts oh, spinning. No. It goes up and down, up and down a lot. <laughs> Uh, you like... hear over you hear over an intercom sequence saying defense system activated. Oh. The uh, disc ball drops down and lasers start shooting out of the. Oh no! Oh god! Make me a dexterity save, both of you. 
Is there, is, what is is this place made of like a stone or is it like a weird? It's a metal-ish compound. Okay. Man. So am I making a deck save? Yep. Never do good at deck saves. That was my second. highest stat. That is my lowest stat. So fun. Don't worry, uh, you'll probably beat me. <laughs> you say that, but I guess so. Yep. I told you you beat me. All right, Richie, take three damage as the laser hits you in the shin. Okay. Uh, as soon as it hits you, it's like, uh, it just says defense system uh, disabled. Uh huh. And then the ball just goes back up in, into the air and closes. Oh, okay. Dude, we we need to get one of those for our house. That is yeah. insane. It's a we disco we... ball that shoots people. When they're misbehaving. Definitely invest in some Atlantean security systems. That's oh. pretty dope. That sounds like a that sounds like a company already. Atlantean security system. Uh, I guess there's nothing really going on here. We should head back. I guess so, dude. Alright. Man, no bootable caches. So as you guys head back, we'll cut back to yeah. uh Tobias and Harry. Alright. Hey, Theodore. Yeah. Got a couple more questions for you. Of course you do. So, uh... We're right to assume you came here to, of course, get the other... Stone tablet, correct? Yes, yes, of course, yes. Now, did you, uh... Whatever it is, stop the kidna. How far did you get in that? Um, like I told you guys, I was in the uh, Bermuda Triangle. Randomly, a uh, whirlpool opened up, and here I am. So you made no progress. Yes, upon waking up from the whirlpool, I was already arrested, if you will. Hmm. You tried working with anyone? Gain any advantages around here? They ha they've been on high alert since I've arrived. They suspect you? He, Would you not? He Some came random here stranger and to find what was just stolen the, the moment he got here. So, What I mean is, do they, like, do they have any evidence that it was you, or is it just what I they believe think? they suspect I was a distraction of some sort. You know, as they were set alarms of, you know, me arriving. And you're telling us that that's, that's not the case. You're telling us that you came here completely innocent. I'm noticed. telling you what I told you. I did not steal the tablet. Am I able to uh, read them at all, or do I need to insight check or anything? Uh, yeah, insight. All right. <laughs> he seems genuine. He did not steal the tablet. Here, look. Since I'm also trying to figure this out, could I also do an insight on him? Yeah, go for it, yeah. If you're just All as right. suspicious of him as I am. I'm always suspicious of him. Fair. As you, as you should. He may be I my brother. He may be my brother, but doesn't mean I trust him that as far as I can throw him, and I can't throw him far. <laughs> as far as you can tell, he, he unknowingly... As... How do, I, how do I word this? As far as you can tell, he did not intentionally have anything to do with the stealing of the tablet. Alright. Sorry if we had, uh, had any concerns about this. See, I thought we were, were beyond the whole accusing each other, you know, after I got you arrested and stuff. I kind of thought we dropped it there. I'd like friends. to be. I'd but, like to be. Just the evidence here does suggest that you had some part in this, and your track record shows that well, it's not well, impossible. It's, it's also the fact that the first time I met you, and you and I told you who I was, you immediately try to put me in jail or get rid of me. Hey, we have way, to live in the past. Yeah, as he said, that's all behind us now. So we apologize for doubting you. I'm doing this to save your guys' life. We understand. Now apparently, I, there's a group of uh, rebels around these parts that may have used you, or at least. Using you as a scapegoat for what they've done. My that part is, yeah, that part is e as uh, easy as to tell, but 
do you know do you have any indication indication i can't even say the word right do you have any idea who they might have been whether was there anyone traveling with you that might have been i was all alone uh found a uh like i told you guys before came alone had my robots with me that i sent back to try to find help which i guess they found you guys in the process all right we trust them. i was on a at, a at a lighthouse did some research there for a few days and then got sucked into the portal i think we were told about your adventures in a lighthouse actually yeah we'll sleep that yeah well all right, so we got a lot to worry about here, but uh, hopefully. So, as you guys are talking, you just start hearing lasers go off. Oh what no! What do you think they're doing? What do you think they're doing? Wait, why did I send those two mm. off? Uh, you know, that probably. You guys were just making them. good lead way with the the guard I heard. I, I was. Gonna... I really was. <laughs> we're gonna be here forever. All right. Um. Yeah. Kid, at least kid, a kid that can't get us here. I guess that's, that's uh, a good thing. Hopefully not. Well, if anything, wouldn't Echidna have, like, some kind of water monster? Like, wasn't it a Kraken, actually? Yeah, it makes no. sense. I don't know. I'm gonna go see what uh, those guys are up to. We're, we're clear here. So go as you uh, start heading out of the room. Bump into them, I guess. Yeah, I, in the doorway, you guys just butt heads. <laughs> what are you guys doing? What do you mean? We're, we're just looking around. We're walking, dude. What was all that noise? Heck? What uh, noise? The, the security system. Why were you tripping security systems? I just pressed the button. Why were you pressing buttons? We're there. Pressed we didn't the trip it. Buttons. We set it off. Of right. One of the guards walks back. What's going on in there? Hmm? We hit too many buttons. We Why are you pressing buttons? Button? My friends are idiots. That's all I can say. We don't know what it Not did. Not wrong. Hey, have you never been curious? About anything, especially if it's scientifically advanced and new. No. Well, nonetheless, the king is oh. ready to see you guys. Actually, oh. do you know where my Great. cup is? I seem to have misplaced it. Yes, it's in it's in, the, it's in holdings. You can. If the king approves of you guys going out to find the tablet, then you guys are worthy of uh, getting your items back. Great. Very well. Okay. Looking forward to speaking with him. But I'm thirsty. We'll quench it this. Here, have, have some water. No, no. He opens the door. <laughs> I already like this guy. And guys, I'm, I'm, we really got to just do what they say and play along until we're at a major disadvantage here. So let's, uh, let's not poke ooh, the fish ooh. bears. I have a good idea then. Okay. I just I don't say anything else. <laughs> Perfect idea. I mean, All right, come on, you guys. Yeah. You have no weapons on your body, correct? I will correct. make a... I will just transparency with you guys. He can be pretty mean with a stick. If it comes down to it. Now, once again, we don't intend any harm, and I'm sure you guys could take care of us if we do plan anything, but... He can sometimes use a stick as a weapon. That's Sir, may I ask you to hand over the stick? I still say nothing. Do you hand over the stick, though? No. I pretend he's not there. <laughs> Can I walk up and try to slowly grab the stick and just pull it away? Yeah. Do you resist? Nope. Okay. <laughs> I, I passed the stick over, knowing that I've hurt Vinny's feelings, but bought us a lot of trust. <laughs> Thank you. They grabbed the stick and said, all right, follow me. And he just starts walking off. At this point, the water is up to your like, chest area. Yep, I follow. Good. Good. Alright. Do you guys just walk out where the door was? Mm -hmm. I suppose so, if we can. Alright, you follow him, and you guys are completely submerged in water. Uh, hey, but you, a... you, you notice you guys can breathe perfectly fine. Oh. oh. Strange. Yeah. I, I I can hear you too. Yeah. Seems we can speak. Can you explain this? Uh, I don't think it's necessary to explain it right now. They got some sort of reason we can do this. We aren't completely savages. We made you guys more advanced. 
Okay, you now, now I want to now I want it explained with that wording. Yeah. What did you? I'm confused. He just starts rubbing his neck a little bit, hinting at you guys a little bit. Touch my neck. <laughs> you feel a scar on your neck. On my neck too. Okay. Do you, anyway, if you feel whoever feels their neck, you just feel the scar on their neck. So it's what not gills. This? That's good. Did you cut me? We inserted you guys with a chip that allows you to breathe and communicate underwater. Is it permanent? Okay. Until the chip is removed or disabled. Okay, we appreciate it. Sure. That's yeah, great. Thank you. <laughs> I'll huh. look into this leader. Mm-hmm. I can be rich. <laughs> More uh, of the fact that I don't feel comfortable with that, but... You know <laughs> they got a Suicide Squad system built into this. It explodes if you betray them. <laughs> that's that's the exact same thought I had, too. Yep. <laughs> Wait, who's the Harley Quinn of our group? Probably Isaac. Definitely Vinny. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I so... continue to say nothing. <laughs> are, are you moving with Vinny a thumbs up? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. His big idea was keeping his mouth shut for once, and it's... Actually, I'm more like floating on my back <laughs> along the water. Uh-oh. All right. So the guard leads you into the palace. In front of you, mm. on a throne, stands a nine-foot-tall uh, serpentoid creature. At his foot is a pet chimera. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Yeah, chimera. Yep. Mm -hmm. and, to, and standing behind him is a beautiful-looking woman. <laughs> Welcome to my palace, he speaks up. Who's she? Happy to be here. That's my wife, Margaret. Hi, Margaret. Nice to meet you. I'm King Landon. Whatever. Hi, Margaret. I give a she little smiles, slight bow and a fork, towards them. Uh, fork tongue out at you. Whoa. Don't we get any like ideas. That. It's a little weird, man. Okay. I'm still just floating next to them, staring intently into the ceiling, saying nothing. <laughs> As you know, I'm Layden. What? Is, who are you guys? My name's Tobias. There's Isaac, Harry, and Vinny. Nice to meet all you. I think some of your guards have met off and uh, Theodore back in the cell. Yes, the other, the other uh, intruder. As I'm sure our guards have already said, we apologize for the uh, rude introduction. It's just, we got to be safe, you know? Hey, your security is good. All we can need, we can it's appreciate that. Protect Lays your people cool. and all that, right? Of course, yeah. you guys yeah. do, like, delivery on those? Delivery on what? You know, the laser security system disco balls. <sighs> we try to keep our technology hidden from the upsiders. I'm Probably. just really cool and I would just really invest it. Well, give it a few centuries and you may have enough tech to be advanced enough to understand our current way of living. Or give me about five minutes with the proper... No, we're looking forward to it. We're excited to see what the future might hold. I try to cut him off as best as I can. <laughs> yeah, because Perry is feeling a little challenged when they yeah. try to... Flex Let on me just the, cut the... off the person blatantly vocalizing that he wants to steal your technology. <laughs> I'm not planning on stealing the technology. I plan on I plan on replicating it and making it better. That's what stealing of... technology is. <laughs> Steve Jobs, you guys. <laughs> I plan on making it better. Okay, Steve Jobs. <laughs> or do you prefer Tesla? So we heard uh, there's been some unfortunate misfallings with uh, some people that are around here. And you think that our friend or us might have something to do with it. We can only tell you that we have nothing to do with it and we would like to help you out. To hopefully curry some favor and uh, maybe get ourselves out of here. Wonderful. We would love to have your help. Us. Being unsure about what to expect, I, I have to keep as many guards as I can here. The, my premise is just 
just for my safety, you know. Makes sense. Your safety, and we're unarmed. It, if I die, the whole civilization could fall. You know, you know how that works. Of course. I, I didn't know that specifically, but okay. We once again don't mean to harm any of your civilization. It's quite impressive. Intriguing. So, well, I'm guessing we should just cut to the chase and saying, you want it? What can you tell us about the group that did steal the tablet? They are, for lack of a better term, a bunch of hood rats. Those that grew up with that a lot in the area, and they, uh, they feel un, they feel like they've gotten the uh, short end of the stick throughout the, throughout the centuries. So they live here. In they live in, in in Atlantis, yes. More, they have migrated to the uh, outskirts as time has passed. Hmm. Okay. So you point us and, in the right direction. Give us all our equipment, and we'll take them down. Also, some more information of what they stole from you would be helpful. Yeah. Did they take anything besides the tablets? Maybe like maybe weapons or something like that. He just looks at you with a dead stare. That is the greatest weapon. Tablet is? Yes. Sorry, we just don't know a lot about it. Didn't mean any disrespect. Yeah. Blatantly lying when I'm saying we don't know much about it, of course. He seems to be pretty trustworthy, so he, he believes you. Like, oh, it's it's yeah. fine. Sorry for my sorry for my rudeness. <laughs> you just let me know whenever I need persuasion and deception rolls in this yep, conversation, because yep, yep. I got them for you. <laughs> Well, in that case, give us our yeah. stuff and we'll we'll get this done. As long as you hold up your end of the wagon. Right. So he uh he starts giving you guys your stuff back. Uh he hands you over uh your you your double sided scimitar back. Then he gets his goblet. I don't take it. I just let it float <laughs> next to me. <laughs> I love this already. It'll float right. for the moment. You get your you get you get the cane back. Uh, he doesn't give you guys any of the rings back. Do I get my earpiece back? You get your earpiece back. You get your uh, hoodie. You get your hoodie back. All right. And my Cheeto hoodie. Yeah, your Cheeto. Yeah, Cheeto's hoodie's back. And uh, he. Bow. You have your bow and arrows back as well. Okay. And he he starts uh, handing you the bag. Hands and hands you your backpack. Okay. Just dead quiet about the contents of the bag, of course. Do I get my uh, cards back as well? Yeah, yeah, you got you, right. you got the missing cards from the from the deck. So it's just everything uh, given back, pretty much. Uh, something specifically withheld. Now. As far as you can tell, you got everything back. <laughs> the rings, right? <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> Except the rings, yes. Yeah, the rings, and you did not receive. Okay. Very good. Yes. All right. So head over to the uh, sunken ship, and I'm, I'm sure you're all you'll find the bandits there. Sure the thing. hoodlums. The friend Isaac Beyond knows his way. way around the ship, so shouldn't be too hard. I'm glad we can help. Wonderful. Yeah. Now be off. Go on. Another short bow. Wish your highness. The chimera kind of, kind of like purrs at you as you walk away. Mm -hmm. As uh, as I'm floating away, I just throw up uh, like a like a f finger guns to the king and the queen, and you just <laughs> keep floating. By. Halt! Stop them! The Vinny, oh. what did you do? He meant no disrespect. It's a term of endearment. Those are cool gestures, like. You see him, like, trying to mm -hmm. do it as well? Oh, it's a little harder with the webbed fingers, but you can kind of get, like, a... Maybe a snub barrel finger gun going or something, you know? Hey! Hey! You little... just seem, like, looking at his hands, like... You, you humans. I guess there is stuff to learn from you yet. Maybe we'll teach you a few more cool things once we get back. Wonderful. Sorry to stop you guys. Go on. Has Vinny grabbed his, uh, stuff... It's just floating along next to me. Oh. 
It comes with me. Very good. <laughs> I would have probably gestured to like push it back and push it towards you or something, but yeah, it just follows you so far. You have you oh, have I noticed did. the uh the the toad statues are no longer with you as well. God. Hmm. Oh, did I get my? Or they just reappear in my pockets. Did I get um? <laughs> did I get my hammer back and everything as well back? Just yeah. Uh. If it was outside the bag, yes. If it was inside the I, bag, then it's in the bag. I always, I always carry down a little tool belt. I always have. And yeah, then you got it back, yes. Okay. Just wanted to make sure. All right. Yeah, we uh, go to leave and proceed towards this uh, ship destination. All right. Do you guys can do anything talking wise before you guys head out? Probably. Keep my thoughts to myself until we're outside of this area. Uh, yeah. Probably a smart idea. Hmm. <laughs> so you guys get outside, and it looks just like a uh, a village outside, like underwater. Okay. Maybe we should ask around, see if anyone can point us in the direction of the ship. I guess so. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Oh. Gonna wander up to the first group of people we see. <laughs> so, I, so from a distance, it looks like they're just talking, you know, playing, just playing games and such. But as you get closer, you notice that they're actually in combat. Oh. Yeah, it appears that uh, at least the, the the group you're heading into now is one race of people that looks similar to the guards or being attacked by some what appears less evolved uh, creatures. Oh. Should we interfere? Do they do anything to us? Or... They're just fighting amongst each other. Can we slide by? You can, you can, yeah, you can try. I'm just, gonna, I'm just gonna slide this way and see what happens. And it's just, does this just look like they're, you know, play fighting or are they fighting to no, the No, this is here? a full on, like, Fantastic. one of the guys just got impaled as, he, as Isaac okay. walked by. So I just walked by and they do nothing to me? They. The uh the one that just got impaled, the uh, one that looks like a guard, you can kind of see on his face a little bit, like, why are you not helping me? Yeah, I, like, literally walk up. You guys need some help. Do we have time to help them? Yes. We... If we want to have goodwill with them, yes. We only, we have nothing but time right now. I don't know about that. I, um... Vinny's just gonna walk forward and just uh just gonna walk up to this one. And uh did I get my stick back or nah? Yeah, he gave you the stick back. Alright, cool. I'm just gonna hit this one in front of me with a stick. Alright. And I'll and I'll, I'll shillelagh it as I'm like reeling back. Please hit. That uh, hits. Okay. He has max damage as well. Woo. So you just bonk him on the head, and he kind of seems like stunned for half a second, and then gets back up and tries to st uh, impel you with his spear. Told you my boy's uh, wicked with the stick. <laughs> Take three piercing damage. Mm -hmm. uh. And he just screamed at you. Why are you attacking me? Vinny just does his best to not make a noise. <laughs> All he's thinking in his head is, I can't lose. I can't lose. I can't lose. <laughs> do you, does anyone else do anything before Vinny strikes again? Um, I'm gonna walk up. And I'm going to do something I don't normally do right away. I'm going to heal this boy who just got got a little bit uh, impaled. Okay. <laughs> now, am I using a powerful spell slot to heal him? No, but I am physically healing this guy to curry favor. So I use uh, my motorcycle healing spell and uh, boom. All right. You see him feel like re re uh, revitalized and he just like, but he still looks kind of panicked and he's just like, I'm... I I got a wife and kids. I got to get back home. And he just runs off and hides into a house. 
No, I wonder Howard. How... Deserter. Can you not yell at them, guys? I'm trying <laughs> to get on our side. <laughs> like, though they look like the guards, they're not wearing any uniforms at all. They, they look, kind of look, look like normal civilians. All right. But they're the same species. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Yeah, I guess we're doing this then. Mm -hmm. All right, if you guys are going to start fighting, roll initiative. I think, yeah, just as that happens, I yell at all the other fish people, stand down and we'll be forced to fight you. <laughs> Seeing if that does anything. But, yeah, definitely ready to fight. Just we don't I know don't anything feel... about the dynamic of people here, so we could easily be making mistakes. Yeah. We'll at least give him a chance to stand oh, I'm down. The... Wait, we're still technically underwater, aren't we? Yeah. <laughs> so our movement's my... going to be low. My fire abilities. Yeah, probably not ideal. Don't think I'll be using my bow. <laughs> oh, luckily I have some backups, backup abilities. Mm-hmm. Yeah, just your hammer rather than the flame weapon might be the better standard attack. My size changing is also probably going to be better for this, suited for this as well. Sure. All right, so this uh, this fish creature over here, seeing you attack its friends, is just going to ignore the... Uh, the guards? The guard species. I don't like it. He has a more aggressive-looking face. And he's just going to swim up to you guys. He's going to try to bite you. Uh, <laughs> yep. Yep. I have my cane out, and I'm like, would you like to surrender? Ah! <laughs> That's a hit. All right, five. He just bites me on the arm. And then he's going to just scratch you with his, with his claws. Sure. With his, with his fins. Okay. Oh, is that two attacks or just the one? Yeah, two attacks. Ooh, three attacks total. Fun. Those are all hits. So... <laughs> So nine damage and take seven uh, light lightning damage. All right, all the damage is the same to me. But... Well, ow. Okay. And uh, one of the fish boys down here is going to just kill one of the. Let me get their actual species name. Uh, Sahugan are the ah, guards. And the other ones are Kuatua. 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 Yeah. So the Kuto is going to kill one of the Sahagad. And now it's your turn, Tobias. All right, lovely. Okay, so they don't want to make peace here. What can we do for fun? Let's see. I feel like my guy is annoying here. But uh, I guess we can go fairly simple. We're just gonna do some classic blessings for the boys. All three of you get the bless. And then I'll try to vicious mock the guy right in front of me. The one who just did the three attacks. This is why I don't like fish. Oh, the DC 16 wisdom save now. What a spell save, DC. We did level up uh, at the end of last session, by the way, people. And I put... <laughs> dumped my points into more charisma. As I think that I'm showcasing this episode. But yeah. You're more terrifying. So he'll take his five damage and disadvantage on his next attack roll. Um, right. Yeah, that was my bonus, so that's all I got. Hmm. Alright, uh, Harry, you're up. Alright. Let me see. Hmm. So I'm going to move up to here, and let's see. Did Vinny, did, uh, Vinny here do anything to this fish yet? Uh, he whacked him with a stick. Bonked him. Alright. I'm going to fire, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to fireball right at my feet. Just kidding. I love how many words you could use to describe hitting someone with a stick. Just plop. Like, clonked just came Whack. to my head, and it's not a word, but it sounds... Exactly like Flubbed. what just happened. Clubbed. Mm -hmm. Thwonked. Flopped. Thwacked. Whacked. Bonked. Schwumped. 
Schwepp. You can make up all kinds of words and they're all fitting. I love it. Anyway, moving on. Monomonopia. <laughs> okay. Let me see. I think, um... Yeah, I'm just gonna take... I'm gonna take up my hammer. I'm going to... Enlarge, reduce myself into a larger size. Mm-hmm. Drop the spell right there. go and i believe that replaces my uh oh, i just deal deal 1d4 bonus damage okay all right question and... side uh does using a um a hammer underwater give you the disadvantage because normally i think that would in underwater combat i just looked up the rules to make sure it's uh pretty much any piercing weapon is fine but Normally, yes, but it seems like, along with the chip, they've done other stuff to make it not so. Okay. Very good. It's weird it for you guys. It doesn't 11 hit it. Uh, mm, I don't believe so. Sorry. No, it does not. Does a 26 hit it? Unfortunately, no. Darn. Hi, AC, uh. guys. AC is a 45. It hits more. Uh, 7 plus a 1d4. Oh. Oops. Been a little bit. There we go. Ooh, max damage on that. So 11 damage. Oh, question. Swank. Since he was blessed, um, would a potential of plus 4 help with that 11 roll? It would. Oh, yeah. That's right. So if you want to... Might as well use the blessing. <laughs> Yeah, so roll a d4, Mario. Okay. And that's added to your attack roll for the first attack. I mean, it's already dead, so... I mean, you can move it to the second guy. Yeah. Yeah. So All if right. you want to move your character, and we'll use the first roll for that, that guy. Over here? Yeah, if, you, if, that's, what, if that's what you want to do. Uh, sure, I already used my two attacks, though. Well... Okay, so roll the first damage on the first attack. Yeah, because one attack killed the thing, so. Alright, so eight damage to that guy. Nice. Alright. Cool. Yeah, right. so uh, the the first attack would have hit, so. Oh, okay. Yep. And then, it's not just eight damage, though. All my attacks have the 1d4 plus, uh, you yeah. know? True. Because you're a big boy. Yeah. There we go. 11 damage. Nice. Consistent 11s. Yeah. Nice. All right, Isaac, you're up. All righty. Since those guys are busy over there, yeah, I will. I will step to here. Mhm. Mm and I will put my hunter's mark on this guy, the the one above me. Okay. And then I'm just gonna swing at it with my scimitar. Mhm. Mm that does. He's still standing. Still standing. Yes. Okay, we'll do the other swing. Still standing. He has been flunked to death. Okay, that's my turn. Nice. Nice, simple. And Vinny. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna hit it with a stick again. Which one? Uh, I will move up and just attack this one next to uh, Tobias. Uh, but I'm gonna come in with like an underhanded swing. Ooh. Right? I'm aiming for right between its little fish legs. Okay. You can fairly say I don't know anything about fish reproductive systems. I'm going to say that is my hit. <laughs> you can uh, do a d4 to it, because of bless. Okay. Oh, uh, actually, real quick. Oh, yeah, your wheel and woe as well. This. Or your, um, yeah, whatever it is. Yeah, it's woe. So that's... Whoa. And then our d4. How's a 14? Okay. 14. I'm the ugly one. Uh, that hits. Okay. okay. I thought that was the will and well you just rolled for. 
No. He was no. also the yeah. first one. First one was villain well. He was just okay. setting it up. The second yeah. one didn't show yet. Okay. Ah. All right. Um. All right. Yep. So seven damage. All right. Bless matters today, uh, everybody. Now it is the fish boy's turn. Yep. Yep. Uh, the Can one get a reaction for aiming for his uh, fish nuts. You will on his turn. <laughs> okay. Which is right after yours, so. Yeah. Okay. Uh, it kind of seems like no effect, almost like their genitalia isn't there. Oh. Darn. Please, don't fact check me on this. I don't know where fish generally Yeah, that's are. what I was saying. Like, I don't know much about the fish reproductive system, so I can't really... Vinny, Vinny wouldn't I feel like, like uh, are they like birds and they kind of just, like, rub? I don't know. Well, I'm I mean, not going to get into let it. Let me Google it real quick, and I'll bring it up on stream. All right, cool. That's a great idea. I want to Google it. <laughs> no. Top of those uh those ads you're gonna get though. Alright, mm -hmm. uh so the fish, uh one of the fish is going to try to bite Harry. Okay. And fail. Yep. Yep. Decent AC guys. Alright. And the one you just hit between the legs, he's just gonna scream out, Why are you helping the rich while we live in poverty? We told and you all to stop. You attacked us first. And then told you to stop. Anyone who helps Ledon needs to die. He puts us through torture every day. I'm and sorry, he, he does what? And as he's saying this, he just uh, he takes two attacks at uh, Vinny. First one at disadvantage. <laughs> Unfortunate. Uh, well, neither of them are uh, problematic, so they'll both hit. Even oh yeah, there. Yeah, it's thirteen, thirteen, nothing. All right, take thirteen, four, seventeen damage. Right. Thirteen hits Vinny. Seventeen. Yeah, five, seven. Yeah, because they both hit. Fifteen, six, seventeen. And then he's going to try to bite uh, Tobias. Fair enough. That misses side. <laughs> wow. Five, all right. All right. Uh, the one beside Isaac is going to uh, try to entangle you into a net. Okay. That's fun. But miss. No. You thought. Uh, two over here are going to kill the Sushugan. And the other one's just going to swim up to Isaac. Oh boy. Those are the annoying ones. White. That hits. And then two swipes. They both hit. Five, fourteen damage. All right. And back to you, Tobias. All right. Well, let's see what I can do here. I guess we're just gonna go for some dozen, and we're gonna. Oh, actually, I forgot. I need to make a concentration check. I'm gonna bless. Because I did get hit by that bite. Yes. Yeah, that'll do. Alright. Okay. So I'm going to try to... I'm going to stab him in the foot. And... My head. That will be... Damage type... <laughs> cold. So there may be a resistance there. I don't know. Um, but yeah. Eight, eight piercing or eight cold damage and then I would like to let's see I'm going to inspire Harry so you have an inspiration die as well now Harry if you need All to right. add it to any attack rolls so we shouldn't be missing people out here mm -hmm. and that's all I can do mm -hmm. so which is the one that proclaimed that we were 
that we were that they tor that they were tortured. The one I just the very the, the very ugly looking one on top of the other fish. I looked at him and said, "What did you mean by your torture?" He enslaves us. They all do. We have to re we have to revolt. We have to be a revolution. Okay, can you explain how they do this? Well, you see, they take the weak and they uh, force them to do labor and whatnot that others don't like to do. Do we understand the concept of slavery? Uh, I don't understand the confusion. It's... Are we on the wrong side of this? I think we are. Can you tell all your people to drop their arms now? Or we'll keep it up. Drop your weapon first. A sign of good faith. <laughs> I dropped my cane, whatever. <laughs> and I put down the hammer... And I say, and I just basically tell them, and a revolution like this isn't gonna solve anything. Just we, if you want change, violence isn't gonna answer this. Can I? Uh, can I do something else to give goodwill? Sure. Uh... <laughs> oh, no, no, I don't want that either. I, I don't want that either. Gonna, Isaac. That's, that's the opposite to... of what I want right now. I'm gonna turn to the people we're protecting and wanna slice at him. Uh, Why are you making things worse? The hits. Assuming that hits. Is he alive? I just want time to choose a side. I don't wanna. <laughs> just cause we're giving it a chance doesn't mean we're choosing right now. Okay, I guess we chose. <laughs> you hear a Killing voice whisper in sides. your head. Yes. Yes, join us. Darn it! <laughs> nah, I'm not saying that I'm joining anybody. But. I want to know exactly what's going on here. You just like to incite violence, I feel like. <laughs> Woke up this morning and chose violence. So you, you're going to explain exactly so, what it's like living here. So the fish up there, uh, up with uh, you guys, up with Tobias and them, just screams at his men. Conceal your weapons, boys. We're taking them back to the sunken ship. You're welcome. Follow us. And we'll explain everything. As you wish. Pick and just start walking. Came back up. I continue to say nothing and follow along. <laughs> All right. I'm, just, I'm determined to not lose. <laughs> this is the weirdest Vinny. Well, I was it's told really to not. be quiet. It's really so not. So I'm doing exactly he that. He does these things sometimes. Yeah. Yeah. So what do so you So you walk up. You, you guys arrive to the sunken ship. You just see a bunch of their species. Thin realm uh, drinking at a tavern. You see an old man playing a piano. Uh, Vinny's eyes light up at the side of a tavern. <laughs> he begins to sweat underwater. He just looks at Tobias with like puppy dog eyes, like, "Can I go? Can I go? Can I go?" But before uh, we get turn to one of the people this... that was uh, taking us here, are they still here? The ones that yeah, they kind of, as soon as they arrive back, they're kind of like, "Come on, join us!" and they go sit at a table. We'll be right with you. Okay. They're at this table right here. Right. <laughs> I know they kind of all. You can tell them apart, obviously. Mm -hmm. Boys, we got a problem. What? We, you just forced us into a bigger situation. Well, the, the, we they, we don't know if they know, but either way, it looks like there's two sides here. One's the much stronger side that um has the ability to help us breathe underwater, and also currently has Theodore. One's the much weaker side, which we don't know much about. Might be in the right, might not be in the right. But also has the uh, tablet we're looking for. Now, downside about that is if we get this tablet from them, either way we deliver it to the other side. And what would that side do with it? Hard to say. They seem to want it very badly. They also seem to have the Chimera with them. Which... That we need to kill. And that will present its own difficulties. I'm just saying... There's a very good chance we could play both sides here. I feel like we kind of have to, but... Right now, we got trust on both sides. Neither of them know any better. We have distrust we on both tablet. sides as well. Oh, Vinny's like... 
Vinny's like kind of panicky because like, like he has an idea, but he also still doesn't want to lose the game and say anything. <laughs> so he's just kind of like 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 chewing on his nails. Come on, does anyone have any sort of ideas here? Anyone at all? Because I was thinking that even once we get this tablet, we pull out the other side of the tablet, take a look for ourselves before returning it at all. Of course. That was that was a given. Now that's a given. Now whether just looking at it's going to get us everything we need or not, we're gonna find out at that point more than likely we're gonna have to get my brother involved and actually take a look at it but that's gonna be difficult on its own maybe i mean like, we simple. Might, might be easier than all that we clearly have to kill this chimera these people are in bad shape we'll figure a bit more about that if we get the tablet we look at it we then have an army we use them as a distraction to get the other you know parts get theodore kill the chimera and leave yeah, it's just fighting underwater against an under a group of people who have thrived underwater for many, many years. Seems not like a good idea. Look, yeah. Tobias, if there's anyone here, I'm going to put my hand on his shoulder. If there's anyone here that I know can inspire a revolution, it's you. Do we want a revolution? I, I don't care about the... But the, I'm sure we could very easily. They already want to do a revolution. We don't have to inspire anything. But, you just got to force them into a war that they're not ready to fight yet. Yeah, they're not ready to fight. They're all going to die. You've seen what they have in there. They have disco ball lasers, right? It's not that uh, bad, to be honest. Well, that's just what we've seen. We don't know what else they have. We don't need to know. What we need is so, a distraction. Pet chimera. Hold on. That we uh, have to kill. You said there was an older fish there, right? Like an older... Yeah, there's an old man at the uh, choral piano just playing music from his from his childhood. All right. Do, 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 do. <laughs> <laughs> there, I I basically asked the ones that brought us in, who is your leader here? Do you go into there to talk to them? Because we're not with them anymore. Yeah, we haven't gone to yeah, the table I'll, yet. I'll, I'll, I'll do that. Table. Right, I'll uh, do that. Yeah. Let's turn to Vinny. Well, he's going to talk to them. What do you <laughs> think? <laughs> and I think he just a zipper across his mouth. <laughs> and I think that's where I chase. catch on to why Vinny's been acting like this. <laughs> oh. <laughs> hey, I mean, if you want to keep challenging yourself, feel free, but don't do it on my expense. You can speak if you want to. But you're doing great so far. <sighs> um, well. Oh, uh... you lost! What are you doing? <gasps> I'm kidding. It's fine. We'll pretend the game can continue up later. This is a, a bubble. Okay. Um. Well, w what if like, like, ha like a couple of us pre pretended to, uh, um. Like, favor the rebels, and the other two favored the, uh, kingdom. And then we pull a backhand sneaky, grab the stone tablet, kill the chimera, Theodore, and we leave. Yeah, it kind of the chaos it goes on with playing both sides. In all the chaos, we feign a little bit of um, what's the word? Loyalty. Loyalty. Yeah. Like, now the big uh, question is, how much do we care about the politics of a underwater nation that we know nothing about? I kind of think that's the point. If we just feign that we care about it, we can well, pull I mean, the other like, hand and sneaky on them. Do we care what the result is of this conflict whatsoever? I mean, I don't. That's fish one of the be fish people. You know, usually that is your thing. Me? No. Tobias. Usually that's his thing. That's mm. one of the reasons why Vinny, not not Vinny, freaking Harry, is going up to talk to uh, talk to them about it. It's like, how bad is it here? Like, how bad Wait, is it? You decided to just not listen to what I said? Okay, cool. I already, already left. walked off. Oh, I already okay. walked off. Mm -hmm. Okay. Right, so as you uh, approach the uh, gentleman, we'll go cut to their scene. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, welcome. Be merry. For with you guys on our side, we'll be victorious. I know it. I hold my hand up and saying, you don't have us on your side just yet. We need to know the full story. How bad is it? On a scale from Shnu to Vralda, it's about a Vuzah. 
can I guesstimate how how much that is? About an eight out of ten. Okay. And I, I guess I noticed like the mini scars on them, right? Like. Yeah, oh yeah, you can definitely tell, especially on the uh, older gentleman in the piano. You can just see whips, uh, whip lashes on them, and all that. I mean, they use a whip underwater. <sighs> yeah. Technology. Mm-hmm. It's crazy. I just look at it and I just say, I'm guessing this has not been less, this is not, this has not been something recent. Generational, I'm guessing. Uh, centuries. My ancestors have told, told my, my, gener, uh, my grandfather told his, was told by his grandfather, just of the onslaught us, we, our species receives. And I'm guessing they have no, they, there's no sign of them letting up or letting you go, is there? Not unless it's a change. Not unless it's a revolution. Oh, this is interesting. Can why would there be? Laugh. Why would there be change? They're happy the way they have it. Why would they change anything? You're not wrong in that regard. You said you wanted to walk up, Isaac. And just just while we're uh, while that's happening, we're just, just gonna be like, wait, did we leave Harry to talk to them? Uh, yeah, we did. I'm not the worst person to talk to people. If anything, you're you all bad are. for different reasons. <laughs> hey, I get things done. Yeah, you, I think the reason I'm bad is because I don't get things like we're done. Here. We just end up going in circles. We're gonna we're gonna walk into the table. You all give a distinctly different okay. impression of people <laughs> when we're talking to people. <laughs> I think they'll like me. I strongly Probably disagree. The... <laughs> the Slayer of Many, welcome to the table. See. They like me. Welcome. Thank you. So what is yeah, this hey. place? Well, if you look around, it's the sunken ship. Yeah, I, I, I meant like, is this like a safe house? Safe house, tavern, future memorial ground for our victorious victory. As opposed to non-victorious Maybe. <laughs> So, all the more reason for a memorial what, ground. What is your plan? What's your plan? Just keep fighting and hope things change? We... We've already won, basically, at this point. How so? Well, the tablet holds the victory. It, you... hold, it holds the way to, to kill uh, Ladon and, and his pet. V Vinny just slams his hand on the table. You're wrong. You haven't won. Just because you have a stupid piece of rock. You need to be able to enact Vinny? it. He you looks like not... shocked on his face. You can talk? <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Vinny just kind of ignores that comment and just keeps leaving and goes, You can't win until you seize the means of labor. And then once you do, you control the government. Yarp. We will concede, we, will, we will control the, the sense of labor. For when we are in power, we'll force them to do exactly what they did to us. And that doesn't that's... solve any problems. Yeah, then, it, then it's the same situation. Then they become you. Only until the bourgeoisie fish are defeated and removed and the class system de de deleted from this economy, you will never be free. You will always be succumbed to the powers of capitalism. Let's start with and taking the, the bread back. <laughs> yes. Yes, we seize the food and the means of production. <laughs> and then we cripple the bourgeoisie. This is lame! We cannot do that. Look, the death of the king you. is needed. Look. The head of the bourgeoisie is the king. He must be defeated. The king will pay for his crimes. 
But until we seize the means of production, you'll never be free! Oh, no. Okay, can someone make him walk away, please? <laughs> let, let, let's, let's, well, let's get this straight for a second. You, you say that your people are in cap. Does that mean that they have a, a place where they're holding your people? Yes. Okay. So then Underneath the shoot. castle is where they're being held. As you can see, a, a good bit of it escaped. And you say you have the stone tablet. Yes, upon our escape, we uh, we took the means to for power. What's the stone tablet do for you? We believe the stone tablet uh, holds the key of destruction for late on in his pet. The, the chimera. He he values this this rock. For no other reason, as it, we'd, we'd assume. Why else would you keep a crumbly stole stone tablet? No. Could we see this tablet? Maybe we can Maybe we can decipher more than you can. You're going to have to talk to Gr uh, Gregorius about that. Of course. I'm Gregorius. assuming that's your... I'm, I'm <laughs> guessing that is your leader. I'm sure Gregorius would like to speak to the Slayer of Many. Gregorius, come down! He shouts, and the man on the piano just turns around, grabs oh, so a little tiny was... cane, and just starts walking to you guys. Oh, so he was the leader. Okay. Of course. Of the fish. Hello, sunnies. Hello. I, I, I hear you guys are the slayers of many. Indeed. You here to join the revolution? Depend. Depend. I don't think I can support this revolution. <laughs> you can't Not support the bourgeoisie. I know how to get to a man's heart. Can you support alcohol? I can support alcohol. Help us win, and all of our fish wine is yours. I've never had fish wine before. It's like nothing you've ever had before. That, of course, You're it right. is. I he haven't said he had hasn't it had it before. before. That's what that means. He's right. Look. I've never had it before. <laughs> Let's start this over. How about you get a round, of, a round of fish wine in, and we'll have a conversation. I don't want any fish wine. I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> that, I, that, sounds like, that sounds like it's made up with fish oil. I'm not gonna lie. I just, I just, I try to put my hand. Cucumber. Mm. I try to put my hand over, over uh, Tobias's mouth. He'll take a fish. He'll take a fish wine. <laughs> yeah, sure. I, I guess the first thing I want to ask is, besides that, is. When you can we see the tablet? We want to see. We want to see if what you're saying is true, and it holds a way of defeating the king and his pet. Well, out of good faith, yes, but only if you can drink, have a have a little bit of fish wine first. He'll he'll have mine. Puts a round of fish wine at the table. Five. There's five glasses in front of you all. I s slide my cup over towards. Vinny. All right. May I well. uh, quickly grab mine and down it? How I is suppose. It? Somehow. <laughs> and not without... sure how underwater liquids work. <laughs> it's guess... just a more dense liquid than the water around it. So oh god, it's no, just very it's, thick. It's all. It's uh, literally. It's literally oil. just fish. This fish oil. It's fish oil. I've had fish oil in my mouth. But is it alcoholic? You feel a little tingle going down your throat? Good enough for me. I'll drink the other one. I guess I'll down it just so just so the guy can trust me. But before, actually, before I down, uh, before I down, uh, uh, Tobias's, I take out a little, like, a little vial of Vinny Brew and just put a few drops in. See how it reacts. <laughs> That'll waken it up. There's like a tiny little nuclear cloud pops out of it as you mix it. <laughs> <laughs> The and thing that I, can uh, the the Vinny brew that can also power speedboats, a yep. boating for some uh, somehow. Yep. It's like a Swiss Army knife. It just. All right, as you drink it, you kind of feel your stomach start start to rumble a little bit, and you start burping up uh, bubbles. It's uh, kind of cool. That's a good feeling. And I guess I'll just down mine without adding anything to it. Oh, I'm so ready. To it kind of it has a very uh, offsetting taste at first. But it has a really good aftertaste. Not bad. 
I'm guessing my character's a little used to that kind of thing because Vinny's probably had You've had Vinny Bruce that... and nothing's bad to you at this point. <laughs> and See, I've been tempering you all. And not only that, I'm imagine since as we stated before, Harry and Vinny have known each other for years, and I'm pretty sure Vinny has probably tested out drinks on him before. Oh, probably, yeah. You remember those movie nights? Exactly. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> we, we have movie nights? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I've also drank mine. Mm-hmm. I didn't, so, didn't have a he reaches into his, uh, in, into his pouch <laughs> and brings out the stone tablet. I believe this is what you wanted to see, and he kind of just holds it in his hand, like showcasing it off to you guys. We All examine right. the tablet. Yeah, we examine it. Hey, it appears to be the other side of the tablet that you guys had. Can we read what it says? It is still in a Atlantean text. Can we request a room of privacy to fully examine and investigate this tablet? Uh, we'll keep sh- it guarded. We don't yeah. plan on doing anything. Keep, yeah, the keep the room guarded. We're not going to take it anyway. We just need some yeah. privacy to you know, fully understand this magical artifact. Yeah, just uh, head below deck. That should be fine. Hmm. As you wish. There's like a hole in the middle of the ship. You guys can okay. just go below the floorboard. So you go below as the we're leaving, and we're alone. As, as we're leaving, can I grab another tanker of, uh, tankard of uh, fish wine and scream for the proletariat? <laughs> <laughs> Viva la revolution! And they all just Viva la revolution! <laughs> Didn't know what to all were French. All right. <laughs> all right, we, we got up below deck. I didn't know we're they were actually the Quartois. 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 All right, we're alone. We have a moment. All right. Let's I know what you want to do, right. but if, if we do that, there may not be any undoing it. That's fine. We should see what it says, and while we're alone, we'll take this moment. Then we can decide what we should do next. Yeah, I guess. As long as we don't, like, stick them together, we can kind of figure out what it means, right? If we can't understand them that well. Yeah. I mean, if we just put them real close to each other. Wait, hold on. Just put them together. Maybe it's possible. I mean, there's... The only thing that can magically mend rocks is me, so... Yeah. Hold on, hold on. Can I cast the spell quick? What spell? Identify. Uh, okay. Drop it in chat. And what are your intentions? If this is if this is written in in uh, if this is all if this is magic and uh, and has Atlantean writing, I may be able to use this spell to learn Atlantean and and all that. Doing this, I don't think you can do that with identify, but you will be able to learn more about the item itself. <clears throat> Mm-hmm. Uh, you can tell. Hmm. It's not magical by any means. Okay. Yeah, the stone itself is not magical, nor does it have any magical properties. Hey, Harry, you want to try that out with our uh, fish implants or whatever? I don't know if you're able to I, do that. I... I would need to physically touch it, and if you want me to, if you want me to stick my finger hey, Vinny. in your neck, huh? You want to do us a favor? What's up? <laughs> um, I'd like to know a little more about those implants that we were given. Well, uh, okay, dude. And I, I think that either you or Isaac might be the uh, best, best options for uh. Getting a closer look at one of them. Go for it, dude. There you go, Harold. Stick your fingers in his throat. All right. Whoa, I need whoa, that... whoa. Wash I... your hands first. <laughs> All right. I'll wash my hands as I just go, like, in the <laughs> air. <laughs> yeah, just. All right, washed. <laughs> <laughs> I need you sticking your dirty fingies in my neck, dude. <laughs> All right, alright. I'll take a little Vinny brew. So Sanitize. we need so we need, <laughs> we, need a, we need to open up where they where they cut into us. So anyone want to volunteer and have, take the knife there? Uh, anyone have a knife? Yeah, but would you consider yourself good at that sort of thing, Isaac? I could try. I mean, yeah, I guess I carve things yeah, a lot. Yeah, you don't think you'll go too deep? Or Listen, nothing? dude. 
Worst ah, piece of worst, you cut my head off. Not well, the first time. <laughs> Alright, well, I'm what? gonna just kind of dig into him with my knife. Follow the, the scar line or whatever. Yeah, just kind of. This might sting a little. Slowly <laughs> carving down his neck. Kind of get to the chip. <laughs> Stick my fingers in there. Open it wide. And take a look. <laughs> All right, so as soon as he opens it up wide enough, I'm going to... First off, do me a medicine check to see yeah, how well Yeah, the medicine check is what I was imagining is about to happen here. Yeah. I only got a plus three, but it's not nothing. Can I, uh, oh. can I help him out oh. since I'm there? <laughs> how do you intend to help him out? I just coach him. I coach him on how to do it. Uh, Yeah, roll me a medicine check as well just to help. <laughs> Okay. Give him advantage on it. <laughs> oh no! That's a plus seven, by the way. I rolled yep. a two. I'll say between both of you guys working together and you know, you knowing your body better than anybody else, you're able to. I've done this before, dude. Don't worry. <laughs> like the coach, the coach, someone I'm giving me stitches. I'm doing so, it more so. Well, nice get wild, dude. So what'd you find in there? Uh. uh it looks like a uh, it's weird. It's like it a like futuristic looking microchip. Yeah. Right. So I grasp, I touch it with a finger and then I cast identify on it. <laughs> so he, he sticks his head into his <laughs> neck. <laughs> uh, it's definitely not, it's not magical. You can definitely tell that. But okay. as you touch and it, you can feel like you feel like the electrical circuits throughout it working. Yeah, man, at least ask first or bring me out to dinner or something. Jeez. Do not talk. We don't it's need to make this weird. weird. Yeah. As he talks, it kind of like crunches on your hand a little bit. Yeah, you feel his, his tendons moving in there. <laughs> okay. So, All right. Um, as quickly as possible. What do, I, what do I understand about this ship now? I, I, just, I, just, I just wanted you to test if it was magical. If so, we might be able to do something about it. But if it's technological, we best just leave it in there because we are not experts. Right. Yeah. So. All right. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. It's technology. It's not magic. As I will remove my finger from the inside of his neck. Yeah. Get a little Vinnie Brew. Clear it out. Sew it up. I'll just cure wounds it. Yeah. That's what I'll I just, figured. Just close it up. Okay. Know. All right. So we learned nothing, but not much we can do about it. Hold on. Uh. I assume if there was a physical explosive in there, you might have noticed something else, so maybe we yeah. got something. Yeah, I don't think they put explosives in us. That's the good thing. Can we, they we even can do that underwater? How would they get gunpowder? Sunken so ships, army, when uh, World War II happened. more than just gunpowder, that's explosive. I like eye up the Vinny brew. I don't know wrong. what you're talking about. You're right, explosive and flavor, dude. <laughs> You got me there. But like, uh, more importantly, the tablet. Also actually explosive. Yeah, so... We're not able to read the tablet. I mean, um, I think we should just see what happens when we go. Yeah, I mean, worst case scenario, we just follow through with one of our bad plans regardless, so... I mean, worst yeah. comes to worst, we just fight our way out of here, dude. Not like the One way or another, no matter right that. How much planning we do, something's gonna go horribly wrong. It always it right happens. This way. Let's do it. What if we found another stone and made a replica? Or I could I could have my robot use this photographic memory and actually, you know, legitimately take a photo of it. Are you trying to use a robot underwater? I think we need the stone. I think we we've established beforehand that he's waterproof. Have we? I been, remember that. Didn't he go in the water in one of the islands, fighting? Like in the water and that. deep underwater, yeah, are very different things. There's, yeah, it's very different. And how when you hit your phone, it says waterproof. Right. On <laughs> that, like, yeah. That's like the equivalent of splashing water on your phone and throwing it into the ocean. <laughs> and either way, Harry grabbed the other piece of the stone. I'm just saying, I don't think you risk it. All right, I reach into the bag for the other piece. And yeah. find nothing. Hmm. I'm sorry, what? As I... Eh, as I nothing's the wrong choice of words. 
You don't find the stone tablet. Issue? Yeah. What? Well, Harry? It's not in here. Is your other stuff in there? Uh... Is my other stuff in there? Like, do I pull out one of my mini, mini scrap metal items? Yep. Do I pull out the orb of direction? Yep. Getting to the on there. So they wow. went into the bag and they took out a piece of the tablet. They want the other piece so that they can use it, potentially uh... against these poor people. Yeah. Okay. Turns out that they uh... still trust them now. We didn't trust them to begin with. It's just they're tough. They're stronger. So. But How yeah. Did... How did they even get into here? I don't know. Honestly, they must have had some sort of inkling that we had some. I suggest a new plan. Tobias goes out there, and he 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 gets them ready for war. We they, use them. They go in, rescue their people. They get Theodore. We take this half the tablet, and we go to the king. We start with a conversation. Ask them about our missing artifact. Depending on how that conversation goes, we deal with him and the Chimera. We let the rest of them deal with whatever else. Yeah, I'd prefer to be on the negotiation team rather than the preparing fish for war team. I'm going to be honest. I'll, pre I'll help the fish prepare for war in the event. I, I mean, I think they, they know what they're doing like better than us. I mean, I just wanted you to inspire them to go to war right now. I don't think that's difficult. They're all talking upstairs about going to war right now. Once again, this is not a difficult task. Well, then we'll give them a plan. The only thing they need to do for us is get Theodore. They can get the rest of their people. We can deal with I the mean, king. It might be best if I go into the building, because, like, I can just become a fish, dude. We're all going to go in the building. No, I meant, like, I shouldn't be on the war-preparing team, because apparently they don't like my idea of toppling the bourgeoisie. I mean, oh, they're no, doomed no, no. to fail. I don't think any of us need to go with them. Oh, okay. We're gonna go to the king. Yeah. Okay. We, just need, we need them to get Theodore, and they can save their people and be a big distraction for any other gods. Okay. Guess okay. it wouldn't hurt if they can also get Theodore. Yeah, they can do yeah, us a favor. Theodore is important. We can go to the king, get the other piece of the tablet. And do we leave this All piece of the food? tablet here, or do we take it with us? No. I don't know if no. we'll be coming back here. Yeah. How do you plan on us getting out again? I figure once we kill them, there's going to be an easy way out. Huh? We're, do you want us to kill these people? The king. Well, the fish. B no, we're talking I mean, about. We're how do we get out of this room? Oh, yeah. Well, we we walk out we, and tell them our walk plan. Walk out. They, they're our yeah. friends. Yeah, like if, if we go through with this plan, we're clearly on their side. So. Yeah. Okay. We're picking a side here. Vinny right. is, like, completely lost, but he's just going to agree. Look, if we need to kill this guy, Mara, so we can all get out of here and survive, I don't think that's going to happen if we side with the uh They're not going to let us just kill the Chimera. So, yeah, this picking a side might be the only way. It's going to be the harder way, for sure. But I'd rather go in with all of these than go in alone. Yeah, that at least gives us a chance. True. I mean... I don't think we'll have that much of an issue. We did kill a giant electric dragon recently. Sure. Yeah, but we didn't kill a giant electric dragon inside a throne room full of gods and a king. You're That's not why wrong. we send them in first. Maybe we can draw some of the gods out. Hopefully. Okay. We, we, okay. But you did see that they weren't putting that much of a fight. We might have to prepare them a little more i don't think that was a full-on attack i think if we go out there and we tell them it's time to strike everybody they oh, have in fairness question. they were winning they were what winning quite. too yeah well, i think actually what... they're kind of scared they were hiding up in that throne room i mean they did look a little spooked in. so maybe and we didn't see out. any other gods besides those Ho few that we saw hold on how much you want to bet that these guys outnumber the royalty three to one, and that I mean here. that's pretty typically how the lower class works, dude. And you gotta remember, there's apparently in their basement a whole load more waiting to be freed. 
There's an army inside that castle. So Please what you're saying is, we let them out, we cause the chaos necessary, lock the king in his throne room, force him into a deal, and say, I your life or the tablet, pick one. They seem pretty adamant on him dying, though. We also need to kill the king. Well, we don't worry about what happens after he's dead, or after we leave. We need to kill he the chimera. He can live or die. It doesn't matter. Exactly. We have to kill the chimera. What happens to him is none of I can say. Exactly. We'll leave his fate up to them if that's what it comes to. It's not a bad plan. If we attack the chimera and refuse to give him the tablet, then he might stop fighting us, though. Then we'll kill him. I think we wait for him to try and send the chimera on us. I'll be honest. Because that makes our job a lot easier. Yeah, sure. Chimera attacking Come us, on. making it easier. What a great way of looking at it. Either way, we're going to fight a Chimera. Yep. Is there a point? It's okay. unavoidable. Either way, the thing needs to die, so... So are we on board with the plan? Yeah, I think it's a good idea. Yeah. For our specific goals, this is the best plan we got. And let's talk to Gregorius. I guess we go upstairs. Also, uh, side, I forget, but I assume that when we had the two tablets out and, like, pushed them together, no big magic boom or anything like that? We didn't have the two. We didn't oh, have the two Oh, yeah, that's right. Sorry. I forgot about that. <laughs> can't do that. I was like, did I forget to say that? Oh, no! <laughs> Yeah, you know that whole part you said about us not having the tablet? Yeah, we actually The whole do. important reason why we just came up with this plan. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we, we're going to go upstairs. Meet right. Gregorius. Welcome back, killer of many. Gregorius, we have a proposition for you. No, I will not marry you. Not a proposal, but anyways. Well, it is a proposal, just not that proposal. <laughs> Different kind of proposed. Look, it's your. It's I your wants to marry your daughter. No. Oh, your granddaughter. You got. You got with? someone for Isaac. He does yeah, like fish. Very... Gay height. It it would know, be very age. benefit. Be very beneficial if uh, she's also taller than him. He's into that sort of thing. Yeah. <laughs> Penelope. He screams. A, fish, a giant fish just starts swimming at you. Oh. Go this get him, no killer. Way. <laughs> no, we're, here. Back. we're not here for that. We're here. Oh, yeah, we're maybe not? after. Maybe after. We're here for war. Right? Victory. How I many? See. How many you of men? A war veteran are ready. first. How many are ready for battle right now? He swims up a little bit. One, two, three. Usha, hai, wo, da, da. About one. All right. And how many do uh, the opposition have? Would you say? How's that out of a hundred? Seven. Seven. Okay, so the number game, I don't know if it's very effective here, but... You have seven men ready for battle. Uh, seven to there every hundred. Does anyone know this math? <laughs> I can guess. That means we're sorely outnumbered. All right, what does Harry guesstimate that means? <laughs> seven to every 100 of theirs? By, that by that every 200, grammar. we have 14. <laughs> So do they outnumber us? Yes, seven to a hundred. <laughs> you look. This fish speaks weird, man. I'm trying to figure it out. <laughs> yeah. The numbers don't means. matter. We only need five to win. What? I feel like you're just saying arbitrary num num numbers now. You're just counting us. What do you mean we only need five? Because their number system is a little weird. Or well, maybe no. five's like a big number for them. Or this man looked at the stupid tablet that he has and he knows how to read it. Do you know how to read the tablet? No wonder you guys are a dying civilization. We are not dying. As you can see, we are thriving. What does the tablet say? <sighs> well, this is, only <laughs> this is only half of it. But it says, the rabbit, donkey, and boar... Box, tiger, and no more. Death of the seven shall be by the hand of the five. 
I I look at uh the th th other three. I'm like, oh. Yeah, that's pretty much that. We already knew. And that's just on that half. Correct. And we've seen the other half. Goes into more detail about the uh, what the seven are, to some extent. Mm -hmm. I see. I see. Look, we're, we're gonna make a deal with you, okay? Get every single person ready for battle. We storm their castle. We he, he just whistles. Below. He just whistles very loudly. They all grab their spears. Yeah, you see, I so told you this wasn't exactly going to be exactly how exactly right, how did you expect the tablet to help you if that's what it says? Well, we need we need the five. Clearly, you guys aren't it. You're only four. Yeah, where's Bell at? Damn it, Bell! Wait, did she not step into the thing? What we all did? You have you have a fifth. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. The killer of many. The killer of many. No. They all start changing. The killer of many. The killer of many. Okay. Okay. Just okay. 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 I, I know we're kind of famous these days, but look, we have a plan. You have an army under that castle, right? I don't know how good they'll be out of an army. But there are a whole bunch of people. They'll be good as a they're, distraction. They're fish. There, are, there are people. Yes. Then what we need to do is unleash those people. We're gonna get our friend Fyodor. We're gonna storm oh. the king's throne room. We're gonna friend lock him is in. A strong word. And the four out of the five will take care of the king. We will deal with the king. We're, we're doomed to fail. We need the fifth. Well, we'll get a fifth, all right? We'll find a fifth. Theodore's in there. We can get the fifth, right? I mean, right, guys? it needs to be the fifth. If it's a Rabbit, donkey, beast. boar, fox, tiger, and no more. We need our boar. We need our boar. So we'll get that Maybe going. they've got Bell the, with their people. Maybe. Whatever they're doing down there. We'll have to ask. And if not, uh, we got a quick Rocky Talkie call to make. We'll, we'll, oh, we'll get them. still have the Rocky Talkie? Oh, that would totally work under Every, water. Everyone has a Rocky Talkie. He made, oh, I specifically... Yeah. I specifically made one for everyone. Can I pull mine out and scream into it? Yeah, right? you you just hear th your voice echo three times out of everybody's okay. pocket. Okay, yep. Alright. So I liked it better when he didn't water. talk. Uh, Do we get a response so he just from looks Bell? Sad. He just curls up, but he floats away instead. So we, uh, our primary focus is to take down this Chimera. So that's going to be one of the first things we want to do. You want to kill that thing. Yeah. Because the Chimera is one of the seven. Yeah. That's important. Question to you, to us. How many of these seven have we taken down so far? Because I feel we like we're getting the close. Hydra. The dragon. Well, we just took out the dragon. The Hydra. Dra dragon. Cyclops. Cyclops. Sphinx. Sphinx. Medusa. Medusa. So we're five out of seven? At least. There might be another one we're forgetting so that would about. make six for the Chimera. I'm, I'm going to do and an intelligence roll to see if I remember any other one, side. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to do an intelligence roll in real life to see if I can remember a single thing. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> Just Tobias, you, remember. You remember the uh, book from the lighthouse listed all seven being... Mm -hmm. The uh, Cyclops, uh, Hydra, Medusa, Sphinx, the uh, dra the uh, the dragon that had a special name, yeah. Cochlean Dragon, mm -hmm. uh, the Chimera, and Ladon. Oh. 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 Wait, oh. We had to kill him the whole time? Whoops. <laughs> now that I think plan. about Tobias, it, he might be the guy. Tobias' his eyes just light up like, oh, wait a minute. We might actually, that might be the one, the one at the s seven. There might be two of them at once. Oh, it's, oh. We I got a new plan. How about this? We'll bring you his, the king's head on a platter, as well as the chimera. All you need to do is let us have the tablets afterwards. Unacceptable. We'll free your people. Unacceptable. Why the tablet must be returned to the, the final resting place. We'll, we'll bring the tablet back when we're done with it. it. No, it's going there right now. Right now. We right now. Need it right now. Wait, what do you mean? Final what do you mean for? You know, you know what it says. Yeah, but we. 
How do you think we're going to well, get into the throne room? We came here to yeah. get the tablet back. They still think it's, we're working with them. It's a bargaining chip. We need to put them together, the pieces. And if we win, you'll get it back anyway. And if you, you and if we're the five, we can't fail, can we? You don't stand a chance without us. You need us. Hmm. We are your secret weapon, somehow. We didn't. I we didn't are the slayers of many. Weapon. Hmm. Viva la resistance. Um, hmm. Can I? I can't do anything. Sorry. I'd be like persuasion roll, please. <laughs> I was like, I was like, hmm, wonder if I charm him if that'll work, but it didn't. He, he seems very adamant about this. But what if I just rolled twenty persuasion? Then you know, it's go for, try it. Okay, so I didn't roll a twenty persuasion. Hmm. You actually have disadvantage. I'm sorry. Oh, By chance, can he roll a negative so I can woe him? <laughs> Dang it. No, no, uh. Hmm. Mm. What would be the persuasion counter? Um. It's stubbornness. <laughs> um, uh, charisma? Yeah, if it. Uh, depends. Perception, charisma or wisdom? Maybe? Yeah, either charisma or wisdom. I'd say in this case, if he's yeah. that adamant about it, whichever's higher. Cool. Mm hmm. Dang. All right. You have to promise me this returns to the final resting place. Unless we die. It'll be which, fine. If the prophecy is and, true, we'll be fine. And if you do yep. die, that will be the final resting place. True. Yeah, well, well. if you want to say it like that, that's accurate. You have yourself a deal. Get your men ready for battle. They've been clanging their spears around us for the past yeah, 25 they, minutes. They've, they've, they've still been just really? chanting. I've, I've drowned Killer out the, the war mini. chants by now. Oh, the yeah, it doesn't matter. Okay, just get them to botch onto the castle. Let's go. <sighs> they all line up behind you with their spears in hand. Right, and start following you. The armies. Let's go. Yeah, right. Let's for, go. For effect, can I have... Uh, can I have... Uh, what's it called? Wild shape? To get a, <laughs> like a tail? My feet. <laughs> I don't know. What? Uh, you have to go Ooh. all or many. You oh, go. Dang it. Okay, that's fine. I know. It's a well, I assume the I'm Ultra assuming the appearance. CR rating of fish people is pretty high. They're also humanoids, but yeah, yeah. Um. So as you guys start marching off, you hear in the back of your head, Isaac. Army, the battle. We will be victorious. We will be the king of Atlantis. I had a feeling that's what this was about, precious. <laughs> Take out the king, become the king, right? Take care of the king, become the king. I understand what I have to do. We're never going to address this in person, are we? Well, we don't know. <laughs> I know. He's been Probably talking to the ring and we have no idea. I, I honestly think he's just gone insane by at this point because he doesn't even have the ring for this right now. No, he does. No, he yeah. does. That ring was left. Oh, I thought, I I thought that was the one he they didn't the get. Ring is the one. Fox ring was the only one they left from the very yeah, beginning. Fox yeah, all the other ones have been left. taken. Oh, okay. All right. Let's march to battle. Do we want to send them in separately or give them a time? Like, do we want to walk in with them? I think we march. They're following us. May. We must lead them. Yeah. To be fair, we we are kind of the leaders of the revolution. I'm not sure how this happened. <laughs> All right, whatever. We are the five. We can do this four. Yep. Makes sense. So we we're just gonna walk in and not ask them if they have bells somewhere first, or uh... we're gonna go straight into their basement. Free their people and assume that Bell's probably there with them. Oh, that Bell's there with them. You know, like, that's not actually a terrible idea. Let's go. I'm just assuming that if they're using, you know, strong people for slavery, you know what Bell is. Oh, I'm not wrong. Bell is the strongest of the strong. Yeah. So I'm surprised they got them in chains and 
Wait. She can deadlift like 320. God, we're screwed without her. She can't breathe underwater though, so I feel like it'd be very. Well, easy I mean, to get maybe they chains. probably gave her that. I assume, I assume after they, uh, you know. Oh. Yeah. She took her down. Yeah. Yeah, definitely though. 100. 100. percent Let's march. A freedom. To get this over with. All right, so are you guys trying to sneak back into place and escape? Are you going? I don't think we are. I think I think we're straight in. I think we're, we're walking in. up with an army. We're walking in with an army. <laughs> <laughs> what has happened? How has this got so poorly? Of all the things Rich, I planned for, Magic Rich, Theodore has Richie. a pothole. He's like, oh god, what is happening? Why did it, it have to be them? <laughs> Richie happened. What do you mean? Isaac happened. There's an army. There's a goal. Let's have a battle. <laughs> <laughs> Why is this suddenly turned into Lord of the Rings? Because Precious because... is telling me to. <laughs> because he... Because he Richie is living a power fantasy right now. And we're just following along. You know, are we sure we want to march it? They they do outnumber us. Seven to a hundred. No, we don't know that. We've been told that by both sides. <laughs> yeah. Oh. And we know they out weapon them. So. Yeah. Last time we saw them fight, they were winning. One yeah. of these soldiers with <laughs> ten of this. Against, like, the citizens, sure. Oh. Are you scared, Tobias? Yeah, kinda. You're scared for battle. <laughs> I'm kind of torn between them, because on one hand, Vinny, on one hand, Vinny wants to bring down the bourgeoisie. On the other hand, I think death we could isn't certainly really make this a lot him. easier for ourselves if we, you know, be smart about it instead of marching headfirst into a, you know, greater force. We don't know that they're a greater force. No, we, we don't no know. Which is all the more reason to be smarter. So what you're saying is guerrilla warfare. You want to you want to employ guerrilla tactics? I mean, it's a modern way. Modern problems require modern solutions. I don't know if this is a modern problem. I think this is a future technology problem. And I don't think guerrilla mod warfare is considered modern anymore. Guerrilla warfare with laser guns, though. <laughs> well, then what so... about this? We send our army in. We'll sneak in the back. Well, okay. they go in the front. That's a better idea. They still might all die immediately. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, their death is not important to us. No, but their yeah, level of distraction. Your cause. As, as long as we Wait. kill them. Oh. They're ready. We know they're ready. We just don't know if they're effective. We had to fight them. They went bad. No. I just pull a Vinnie brew out of my back pocket and a second one and shakily hand it to Tobias and say, we're going to need this. There's a chanting army of fish all around us as we're like, guys, uh... <laughs> <laughs> You're probably wondering how we got here. <laughs> so as you guys are heading back to the castle, yeah, you get intercepted home. by a wave of their army heading to the sunken ship. Oh! <laughs> Can we hide? <laughs> so I don't see him. No. no. We have a oh fish my. army with us. We can't hide. Oh, man. Okay. Okay. Can we send them into battle? They're waiting for your command. Hold. They get the spirit at the ready. One of the guys on the other side starts talking. What are you guys doing? Should, should we step <laughs> forward and negotiate? Well, we're... You can try. We see you to get the, the, the thing from these hooligans. Where's the tablet? We have um... the tablet. Oh, it out. Tell them that. Oh yeah, we need to tell them that. And we're bringing Give it. Give us. Hand it over now. 
that's not going to happen. Uh, you see, we were told the to king commands it. Hand it over. We were told to hand deliver it to the king. He's not my king. Shut up. We have our own demands. We want the other half. We the brought it here. Stole. That cannot the be one. done. The one you stole from us. The two sides must be united. Which is our intention. They must be united by Ladon himself. That is not our intention. All you who are about to fight against us. How are you treated? How do these higher ups treat you? Is this what you want? One of the guys in the back just shouts, Pretty well, actually. They have a really good dental plan. Darn it. No fish need good dental need plans. No fish needed dentists. Dreads. Medical Tobias? systems. They just paid for my kid's surgery. I think Threats. it's They have free health care. We had a plan B? How can yeah. we be free health care? What, you think like they I just say. have mines out there sitting as they're walking no, towards No, no, us? no, no. Well, maybe, <laughs> actually. <laughs> but I was thinking we send these guys in the battle. Let's step over to the side and walk around. But then they'll all die and we won't have them anymore. They'll put up a good fight. I we'll think, go straight to the king. I think the best chance of having them still as a viable resource to help us would be to help fight these things right now. Fighting all these fish is probably easier Mine's than taking down land the king. Mine what do you think? You guys want to fight now or you want to skip this and go, go right to the difficult and get swarmed from behind when all these guys are killed? You remember what Ladon said, right? What did he say? What did he say? It falls if he dies. Okay. Uh, yeah, that makes sense. He specifically said those words. Does that mean, like, his army just literally cripples itself? No, I have an, another idea in mind, but I think we need to get to the king. I think so what you're saying king, is we... This is all over. Does anyone have the ability to teleport by any chance? Nope. No. Well... Yes. Well... Do you? Depends. On what? Side, right. what do we think about Dimension Door? <laughs> Let me look that up again. I was Level not four spell about slot. That. It's uh I don't think I can teleport all of us, that being said. I'm pretty sure Dimension Door literally just opens up a door. Yeah, a door and people can walk through it, but I think I can only take like one person through it with me. You teleport yourself. You can bring along objects. And as long as you walk, right? uh, you you can bring objects along as as long as their weight doesn't exceed what you can carry, you can bring along one willing creature. Yeah, and they must be within five feet of you. Mm -hmm. So I can't bring us all. Can you carry those guys? <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't. I don't think that's the intention of the word. To go to spell. I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> I mean, if it's yeah. depends, are we just objects to you, Tobias? <laughs> Are we just meat sacks? <laughs> Sometimes, right, yeah. Sometimes. Everyone, hop in the bag. Yep. <laughs> Hold Good your plan. breath, everybody. I <laughs> believe our army can withstand for a little while. We can sneak in. Okay. Get to the king. Deal with him. And it'll all be over. Yeah, probably. I'm gonna pretend I understand what you just said, but I will follow along. You know me as someone who likes bloodshed, but right now, there's a smarter play. Yeah, that's the, that's the thing I'm scared of. All right. All right, I guess we'll yeah. follow the boy who's LARPing. Let's go. Another question side. Would you consider our time on the ship as a short rest? Yes. Thank you. <laughs> Well, also, weren't we, like, supposedly, like, unconscious for enough time for them to put a chip in our neck? Yeah. But... I mean, it started the session, but, I mean... Yeah, we're we're I'm at half health right now, is what we're saying. Oh, yeah. yeah. You, had under, you had under half on that? Come on, man. Yeah. yeah, I didn't. Yeah, yeah I'm gonna go ahead and... Dad there. I'm gonna go ahead and roll mine, then, if that's the case. It's a good idea. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, you'll probably need it. Yeah, I got hit pretty hard. I was like, I'm... 14... 
Okay, that's one. Do. That's more than enough, yeah. I hate to break it the tense moment, but I need health. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Okay, level three? Yeah. Man, only okay. Level. All right, so you guys are just charging into battle? No, no. No? What was the plan again? So we are sending all of these people into battle. And while they are distracted, we are sneaking by ahead to the king. Alright. Well, the guy who was talking to you just speaks up again. Hand over the stone, and we will go. We will escort you to Ladon himself. How about you escort us to Ladon with the stone in our possession? I don't think that's a, pl a good plan at all. He's just like looking kind of like. I think that's the worst of Why did I think plans. about this? You gotta remember this army behind us wants to fight them. <laughs> he looks at you. You gotta realize the army behind me wants to fight you. Good point. All right. You gotta realize that not a single one of you intimidate me. I'm just gonna pat eyes. A giant back. wave of energy shoots out of this guy, encumbering you all. Everybody, make me a wisdom check. Okay. Well, nice work, idiot. Good job. Thanks, Isaac. Uh, wisdom Thanks save, I believe. Ah, uh, yes, my plus zero wisdom save. Let's go. Thanks for Yikes. speaking words, jerk. When have I not? <laughs> Good thing my wisdom's at, like, super high. It's maxed. You know what? I'm, I'm going to use a luck point to re-roll that wisdom save. I'm terrified here. Yeah, I can't re-roll that, so I'm screwed. Oh, there we well, go. Well, that's unfortunate. Probably no different. Doesn't matter. Yep. Okay. Yes, I'm the only one who's strong enough. Mm-hmm. Vinny the Wise, they called me. Or your mind was so addled by by alcohol, it's unaffected. <laughs> That's probably more likely, yes. Yeah, so you all fail. You all just get encumbered by fear, minus Vinny. Oh, I was going to say, hello? Wait, my 17 failed? Yeah. And you see your entire army just start and just scatter. You had to speak up. I'm the only one who's conscious. I'm like, yeah, I'm just the like entire... slowly backing up. <laughs> the entire army is not in the front anymore. And the guy you've been speaking with just says, "Charge!" And they all rush at you guys. I'm gonna rush okay. the other way. <laughs> well, that is where we're gonna end the session off. Ah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Congratulations, you guys incited a war. Of course we did. Yep. Yeah, that's now an army of four. Uh, of which more... three are incapacitated. Yeah, we're, we're already trying to run away, so. I yeah, just love the imagery kinda... of Isaac being like, You don't scare me! <laughs> yeah. it was that, like, I wasn't ah. going to do it, but then that choosing a word, man, that got you. You know what's kind of Beautiful funny? I, I, was, I have a spell called Heroism, too, that counteracts this. Do you use a reactionary? And why didn't you uh, use it? It's probably it's an action. It's an yeah, action. we didn't know there was a fear <laughs> effect coming at us. Yeah, there probably oh, wasn't. Well, actually, until specifically, yelled, Clyde, it's me. just a 30 foot cone that gets affected by this spell. The entire army wouldn't be charging up. <laughs> Sorry, you're right. There's a few left. We'll put them back in next week. <laughs> oh, you boy. all were hit by it, which is the thing that matters. Oh, boy. This is a mess. You don't say. I just like the imagery of Vinny just sitting there like a rush of water comes by him as hair goes back. And he's like, ooh. And he's like, ooh. Bro, breeze. And everyone else is <laughs> petrified. Like, uh-oh. He's just like, Sh should I be scared right now? I think I'm going to be scared. Ah. Ah. <laughs> Truth is, Vinny is scared of nothing. Yeah. Except Bell. Not out of bravery. Just Except of... Bell, yeah. <laughs> Terrified of Bell. <laughs> Except I think the funniest part was that if he was going to be scared, it would probably be of Bell or a lack of alcohol. Of which only <laughs> one of them would show up and then he'd be like, I don't know whether to be scared or excited. <laughs> uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Fun little session. Yeah. Uh, yep. Yeah. We started a communist revolution. Mm -hmm. uh, um, it was already underway. We just, you know, we inspired joined. hope. 
and then led it to its death. <laughs> demise, yeah, demise. It was, um... Short-lived. Very short-lived revolution. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Another day, another Doug. Excuse me? Another day, another, another day, dog. another Doug. Okay. This is this is generally why Tobias wasn't a hundred percent for choosing that side right off the get go. Um, yikes. Gonna, yep. Should have looked at this like based on revolutions in history. How well has it gone when they just went army to army? Just, just never works. I mean, I mean, I'll say since you guys you know, started a revolution or assisted in the revolution and kind of uh, escaped from prison, uh -huh. four thousand XP. Fantastic. Holy. Okay. Four grand, big poggies. So now we're at thirty-eight now. Yeah, I'm, for, actually, I'm pretty sure we need like forty-two or like. It's forty-eight. Okay, so it's about fifty thousand. So when we win the war. <laughs> well, I think the series yeah. will be over by the How time. How much we experience get there. do we get for winning a revolutionary war? <laughs> Two. <laughs> How, how much XP do we get for really? dethroning the bourgeoisie? <laughs> at least five. I, I feel mean. like generally oh, when yay. at least countries do that, they get a lot of five experience. But it's, so, five, but it's split evenly among all the soldiers. Oh. <laughs> hey, you only have like an army of 14, so it's not too bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. We should get a big yeah, like split. Said, we outnumber We're them. We're power and leveling we'll them Seven to one hundred. Huh? Yeah. A few revolutions and you may get to level two. Ooh. Pog. If countries were How a D&D &D character, what level would countries be at? <laughs> I don't know if I want to get into that That's conversation. That's probably not a good conversation. <laughs> yeah. I'll show you the solid level 9. What? Alright, all our Australians in chat be proud or offended by being a level 9. So what's it out of? 20. 20. 20. <laughs> mm -hmm. I would put Australia at a solid 16. I don't Ooh. think any country's at 20. So. It's probably fair. No, I think the highest is probably seventeen. Texas is Texas is probably a sixteen. Yeah, for sure. Ten, fourteen. <laughs> Texas, Texas also was, isn't a Texas country. was the one that started off. It's like, hey, starting my new campaign. Hey guys, I reached level two. I'm hoping to hit level three. Oh, never mind. <laughs> yeah, <Eleanor. laughs> Um, Australia gets docked a point from being the max of seventeen in my book. Uh, for the sake of large killer animals. That's on their side, though. That's, that mean. just means they have more experience to grind. They're basically a ranger. Yeah. Yeah, mm. except they aren't on their side because they also kill them. It's true. Ooh. So what what do we rate Australia's wildlife? <laughs> Where Ooh, they 20. Are. 20. A, kangaroo, a kangaroo's like a little seven monk for 21, sure. 21. At least. Maybe. <laughs> have you seen Kangaroo Jack? Mm. Mm, true, yeah, true, true. That's true. That's a 20. All right. Tune in next week for Kangaroo Jack D and D. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> yo! Actually, that gives us a great idea for a D and D campaign. I can't say. <laughs> I'm scared now. Uh, oh, not be not because it's like a bad thing, but because I actually might want to use it. I think we should do a D and D campaign. We start in a zoo, and we're all animals with different animal stats. Uh, Madagascar. Escape Madagascar. <laughs> yeah, the, the penguins get super high a base intelligence. I'll just bring Vinny back. <laughs> But he's just permanently wild chasing. <laughs> yep. That's, so now if each, that's how the each, campaign each. starts. It's four druids and they just can't unship, unshift. <laughs> nice. Moose Lord makes a great point. The Australians did lose a war to emus. <laughs> <laughs> the emus were all rogues, though. They all knew stealth. They all knew mm. They did back, not know you. stealth. No. They were barbarians. Barbarians, they big time. Rage. <laughs> they, they raged. <laughs> they took half damage to the Australians' bullets. Mm -hmm. So this goes to everyone here and chat. You know, what D and D class are you though? Like, Me? if you like, you're, you're, you're if you're you as yourself was put into a D and D game, what class would you be? Bard. Yeah, Zal is definitely a, a bard. It's not a question. Can, a can you shoot a bow? I mean, I can't do any of these things <laughs> technically. <laughs> <laughs> so you're yeah, a human fighter. Shoot fire out of my eyeballs. I guess I could be a reasonable ranger as well. I can shoot a bow, and I'm good with animals, and I know a lot of nature stuff. So druid, got it. <laughs> I don't think I'm druid far. I think I'm ranger far when it comes to the nature scale. I don't think I'm druid far. All right. Uh, that's a good question. I don't know. 
I love everyone's saying, like, wizard and sorcerer. They, yep, I shoot lightning bolts daily. Well, I mean, if you I study a lot and you know a lot of stuff, you can yeah. be a wizard. I can definitely there, see wizard wizardry is just how much thing. you learn about magic. You don't have any innate magic. Yeah. And right, it's, you know, some people, technology is magic. Mm -hmm. True, yeah. Yeah, uh, fair. That being said, I am not a wizard or sorcerer. No. <laughs> uh, I would, if anything, I'd probably put myself at, like, like, bard or, like, druid. At most. <laughs> Don't want to be a warlock. What if one of us just steps out? I'm really a barbarian when it comes down to it. I get angry. <laughs> I, I have anger um, issues. I it's, guess it's... I could maybe be a monk. Because I disappear for eight months out of the year. <laughs> Ain't wrong. All, All right. right. Well, if nothing else, anybody else need to plug anything before we head out? Nope. No, uh, you sure, w you sure w not Mario. No other shows coming tomorrow. Oh, or anything. W w no, we'll, we'll be tomorrow. YouTube.com. Well, we do have the return of the Avatar D and D tomorrow as well. So mm -hmm. long as nothing happens, I think we'll, we'll be all solid for that tomorrow. Remember, it's going to be at 4 p.m. PST, 7 p.m. EST. I still always forget the time. <laughs> what about GMT? Leave that to midnight, GMT. Why not that's... on Bulgarian time? What about that Alaskan time? That's what I am. Oh, Alaskan <laughs> time? Oh, gosh. Depends. <laughs> Are we talking about Anchorage or, like, middle of nowhere, Alaska? <laughs> it's been all of Alaska in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> Anchorage got some stuff there, you know? Oh, okay, like a couple buildings? Yeah, it, okay. it exists. There's, there's a population. That's fair enough. Yeah, what, three? It ain't Montana we're talking about. Come on. Oh, yeah, no, cool. Montana is just fields for days. Yeah. Shout out to all five people that live in Montana. Yeah, I know. Shout out to the five <laughs> population of Montana. What is Montana's population? Let's just... it's, it's probably less than my county. <laughs> no. Uh, population of... Wow, it's actually... For a big state, the population of Montana is only one... About one million. That's what about I thought. One million. All right. Oh, what's, hold on. Wyoming is the lowest populated state. Okay. Fair enough. I'll make fun of my Wyoming. Yeah, Wyoming's small, though, so. Yeah. 580,000. It's not small, but smaller than Montana. Oh, yeah. There Good is many stretches of Wyoming, or um, Montana where there is just nothing. Where is the um, a big park? I can't think the name of that. The National Park? Uh, Yellowstone? Yeah. Isn't that Wyoming? Uh, mm, yes. Yeah, ninety percent of Wyoming is taken up by the Pretty national sure. park. I guess if we're going on lands yeah. to population ratio, then yeah, Alaska will take it. But yeah, yeah. but there's reason for it in Alaska. Yeah, Wyoming's and... small, and a good chunk of it's taken up by Yellowstone. Anyway, and and if Yellowstone went off, it would be gone. <laughs> the no more Wyoming. <laughs> You're Actually, not wrong. Probably no more North America. <laughs> uh, we'll see. We'll see when it happens, right? Yeah, we're apparently due. <laughs> yeah. Not been, to incite fear into people, sorry. We've been due for a while, it's fine. A couple, a couple thousand years. Well, with all that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. If you're watching over on YouTube, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Check out all these wonderful people, plus Yuki down in the description. And we'll YouTube. see you guys next time. www.twitch.tv slash... Is this a side gunner? Side gunner? I don't like... stream on Twitch anymore. Oh. I don't have internet. But yeah, YouTube.com <laughs> slash Side Gunner. Twitter.com slash Side Gunner. YouTube.com slash Side Gunner. I've been play, uh, doing Pokemon videos. Do that. Uh, mm -hmm. Pokemon there. videos. Yeah, Pokemans. <laughs> Pokemon? Pokemon. All right. Bye, everybody. See you guys. Bye. Is it this one? It is. Woo. <laughs>